called White Day. This actually was an auto-played intro. <laughs> I didn't mean for this to happen. Wow, look right into the fucking sun. <laughs> Very good. Why not play the remake? I've heard it's trash. This one's apparently really good. Why would I play the one that's not as good? <laughs> the, uh, the faces are so weird. <laughs> uh. <laughs> she forgot her book. Chat, she forgot her book. What an idiot. She forgot, that's all she... She forgot the book. These people are ghosts. No, they aren't. They aren't, they might be ghosts. Anyways, chat. Okay, as I was saying, this game is apparently a classic and it's very difficult to get running it took me like four hours of time to get this game to run properly on my computer uh you have to tell your computer it's korean for it to run okay it's got a difficulty called real we are not doing this let me explain why okay when you kick up the difficulty above normal they add fucking time limits to the game you can't save the game there's a time limit it's a lot darker and the game is over when it hits midnight as in you just lose the instantly you lose and you die and that if it wasn't for the time limit i'd be intrigued at playing hard but to my knowledge hard also has a time limit yeah there's also a time limit so we're gonna play on normal for the sake of me getting to play the game at all, because I've heard this game is pretty crazy, and I'd rather not go insane. So, we're gonna be playing on normal. Okay, my name is going to be Tomato Gaming. <laughs> my name is Tomato Gaming. We're getting rid of those, those characters that were there, and we're replacing it with Mr. Gaming. Okay? And we're returning to school at the dead of night to do something. Maybe it's getting my tech deck board. Maybe it's something else. Really, there's no telling what, what, I'm, what, I, what could be go, going on, all right? It's time to begin. The master of the labyrinth is waiting for me at the school. Yeah, White Day is like Valentine's Day for th this culture. Okay, Jet, just so you're aware. So, I'm pretty sure the lore is this guy's trying to bring White Day candy in for a girl he likes. You know what I mean? At at midnight, at like very late night for some reason, at like nine nine p.m. for some reason. Are the graphics modded? No. This is how the game looked back in the day. But it's in higher resolution. Uh, 
It's in first person as well, which a lot of people might not be aware of. Hello? Hello? Looks like it's almost... Chat. Looks like it's... What is that? 10 p.m.? You're supposed to beat this game in two hours. It's like real time, I'm pretty sure. My heart is good, as it should be. Let's take a look around. What's this? A coin at the bottom of the... Whoa, 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 whoa. This is a horror game. This one's clear. That is scary. Those toilets are scary. I'll give you one thing. Toilets like that are scary. Yeah, a too dark for me in there. Now we got a coin. It's a coin. I got a coin worth 500 won. You can use it to buy items at vending machines. I see, I see. It's very dark. There will be some small graphical errors, just so you know, with like lighting. That's just a side effect of this game being fucking old and like people working so hard to try to make this game run on modern systems. Okay, so just accept there will be some small issues every once in a while, just because, okay? What is this? It's a pen. I pick it up. Pens are used to save your game. Use them on notepads in restrooms. I don't need to save right now, but maybe I will later. Hello? Oh, the door's open. Was that open before? Chat. Remember, we're here to get my tech deck and get out. The hell? No, 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 no. It's locked. They locked it open. They want me to go over there, but I'm not going over there yet. It's a note. Condition of the main building, 9th of March. Also, just for the record, this is a fan translation. Uh, this game never came out in any language other than Korean. So, just so you know, almost all of this has been modded uh, to work because it doesn't work otherwise. There's a steam leakage in the extractor fans located inside the vents that connect the girls' bathroom and the machine room. The valves inside the vents will need to be tightened to stop the flow of the steam. We will begin placing the fluorescent lights in the hallway in front of the home economics room tomorrow morning. I see, I see. It looks like what they're starting over there. Hang on, I just want to take a look around some of these other places before we move on. Wow, this is actually really dark. Actually, it, it doesn't look that dark, but it feels dark. And do lights work? Yo! This game looks pretty good for how old it is, Jet. To be honest, it's got that Thief 2 sort of lighting. Which works really well for it. How old is it? This came out like 2001. Or 2000. Another note. Kim Byung Tae. The garden rake has been confiscated by Hack Jew, a student dean. I can't rake the school grounds anymore because of you. What's worse, all the trees have died because you didn't water them last week. Trees need water? I thought trees just did it. I'll make you regret your selfishness tomorrow. If you have the spirit, go to the safe in the PE storage room and get my rake back. I overheard from the students that Hakju has a very bad memory, so he remembers the combination for the safe using the number of balls in each basket. Okay. So I can get a rake if I find all the balls in the baskets and count them. It's a... No uh, wait, safe puzzle? Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. That depends. That, uh, but we might stop the stream right now. Actually. This might be an end of stream sort of situation. If it's going to be a safe puzzle. I can't do that today. Not today. I'm not... Ah, whatever. The woman in the closet. Some time ago, rumors began spreading about a face that could be seen coming out of some of the walls in the main building corridors. Whether this was true or not, the principal and several other teachers tried to prove them wrong and reassure them. But the story stubbornly refused to be forgotten. Some students claim that the school was once used as a torture building for prisoners during the Japanese occupation of Korea. They said that one prisoner was a woman who refused to give away the location of her husband, who had fled the region to avoid conscription. She was tortured again and again, but each time she refused to talk. 
When they finally gave up on her, she was left sealed into a closet and forgotten. The closet was so small and compact that she could not sit up or lie down. Crammed into the tiny space without any provisions at all, she eventually died of starvation. When her body was dug up, her discoverers struggled to fit her stiffened corpse into her coffin. They say she still wanders near the sealed room, her bent neck present to those who are unlucky enough to find her. Okay, well, you know, I don't see how that actually could be real. Hang on, I'm gonna break into this locker and take this soybean milk. It'll recover a small bit of my health, but I don't see why that would matter, chat, because I'm just here to pick up my tech deck board. None of this matters. I'm not here to do anything other than get my board for tech deck. It won't open. You guys are gonna have to read yourselves. Bye. <laughs> Bye. And they wave like <laughs> my name is Tomato Gaming. <laughs> Nice to meet you. I am Tomato Gaming. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> you think it's funny? You think my brand is a fucking funny, huh? So, Han So Young's in your class, isn't she? I think this is the girl whose diary or whatever was on that uh, bench. I think the character's trying to... I... I think the school's burning down. Uh, oh, the alarm's just on! <laughs> then the game wants me to turn it off through the vents! What were those textures? I don't know what's going on in this room, chat! Yo, what are you doing? We gotta turn this thing off! Oh, she's gonna make me do it then. Well, fine, I'm gonna take my time. Someone threw away some new coffee. I'm taking it. I got some coffee. I'll be back. I just gotta go. I'm, I'm gonna take my time doing this since you're not helping. There's a wire cutters here. A pair of wire cutters. God, I got it. All right. Let's equip them. I'll find a way in here. Maybe it ain't even locked. All right, it locked. Okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. I will... Get this taken care of. It's a pen. I'll read this note once I'm done turning off the alarm. Oh my god. Hang on, chat. Don't worry. We're gonna get this taken care of. There's a wire net blocking the vents. It's too high to reach. Fuck. Chair? Maybe chair. Yeah? No, no chair. The uh, step ladder. It's a ladder. Pick it up. Don't worry, lady, I'll take care of this, and then we can continue our meaningless conversations. Give me one second. Burr. How do I climb this thing? There we go. I've disintegrated the wire netting. Oh my god, it doesn't even stop if you pause. Chat, that web would be enough to stop me in this game. I wouldn't- I would be unable to pass through this. Webs fucking gross me out. I'm, I don't get grossed out by spiders, really? Huh? Whoops. <laughs> okay, well, uh, you know, that's... That doesn't, doesn't really matter, uh... Unless he has, some. Um, Unless he has my board. I don't think he has my board. I don't think. Uh, I don't think. This is a valve. I gotta turn off the steam. Yo, Fixer171, thanks for the 10 gifted subs, man. I really appreciate it. You're all right, man. Thanks. It's real generous. Let me get all these steam things off, and then we're t the alarm will turn off, and everyone can be happy. Just give me one more second. Turn off the steam. Get the alarm. 
Man, I can't believe I have to do this all for this girl. Why, why, why isn't she just helping? You could have done this so much faster as a team. Okay, I'm in. The machine room looks like hell, and it's full of rubble, which I don't think is school. I don't think this is. I don't think this is to code. Hang on. I can't see it properly. It's too dark. Okay. I gotta turn on the lights. Okay. Let's see here. Warning. The alarms only activate in emergency situations. To stop it, the alarms must be switched off using the switchboard. Got it. Okay. That's good. All right. That's even better. Okay. All right, that's as bad as it can get. Chat, it can only get better from here. <laughs> that's the wrong way. Did it. Fixed it. Yo, lady. Turn it off. I got it. Uh, what the? Maybe. What is that sound? There's a sad dog outside. Oh, it's an amulet. I've I've obtained the mysterious amulet. And a key uh, to home economics, which is next door, I believe. Well, Chad, let's close this up then. No reason to keep it uh, keep it open. It's more respectful to keep this stuff closed so no one gets confused. Let's get the hell out of here. What happened to the room? You tell me, Sherlock. Like, what do you want me to fucking tell you? I, it was one minute it was evil, the next second it was fine. What do you want me to fucking... What do you want me to do? I'm gonna turn off the light. It's more responsible to do that. And I guess we'll climb up now. I can't reach. It's a big box. Okay, it looks like we're actually going to not go this way. We're going into the home economics room. That's fine, I have the key. It's a note. Running. Jogging regularly improves your endurance and reduces your resting time. It is a simple, convenient, and effective exercise for keeping healthy. However, you must be careful when you try to push past your limit. If you ever have difficulty breathing or feel dizzy, you should rest for a while before going running again. Is this a game mechanic? Should I be running? Everywhere? I think I gotta run everywhere. Guys, you know what I'm really happy about? I haven't saved once, but the game's already given me three save pens. Which means this game might actually respect my time. To a crazy extent. Which I can't believe. Maybe, just maybe, this one won't, uh, like, just fucking give me a complete save drought. It's locked. Wait, but I have a key. Hey! Whoever, whoever it was that was outside, I'm locked inside home economics! I don't know how to... Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, I have to click on this exact pixel. The door's unlocked. I'm out. There's something else I wanted to talk about. The machine room looks strange to me. Hospital during the Korean War. Will I be staying here? Well, you're just hanging around the whole time. The school locks up at 10! But it's 10, I'm stuck here. <laughs> How do I get out? How do I leave, Ned? How, what are you going to do? <laughs> Why is it so cold? There's many questions. How do I get out? You're afraid, don't be a wuss. Okay, lady, take it easy. She's giving me another key. A way out in the gym? So you're just gonna hang out here? Is that like... Okay. 
really sort of feel like she's a ghost now because she's just hanging out and totally fine and totally fine with this construction memo the main building's first floor needs some lighting work oddly enough the switchboard wires in the machine room are tangled up so we may need to strip a lot of the flat the floorboards and wall sheets back if this work is needed then the extractor fan connected to the machine room home economics room and the girls bathroom will need to be removed okay do i have like a i have a phone only available for easy mode oh sorry guys only fucking losers need phones come on chat give it up you get like, you get a phone that I think gives you the answers to game mechanics. But I'm not a pussy, you know? I want to follow the janitor and see if he would kill me, but I guess that's not happening. It's time we save. We're gonna save. You can use a pen to save your progress here. Would you like to save the game? Yes. There was my test game where I made sure the game saved and worked. I'm amazed this game does work, and it runs well. It actually runs beautifully for how old and crusty it is. Guys, this game might be the crustiest game I've ever streamed. Like, for the record, the amount of just fucking shit I had to do to get this game to run, and the fact that it runs well-ish, is amazing to me. Because it is old. Anyways, let's uh, pop this bad boy open. Now, I will warn you, chat. This is about as far as I got last time because the spook factor starts to pick up. I didn't want to spoil anything for myself. But, uh, place starts to get a little more fucking spooky as you get larger, farther into the school. A picture of a girl holding a dog. I wish there was a dog here right about now. Like a cool dog. Like one that could talk and give me fun tips about the game. Where's Minmo? Minmo wouldn't fucking help at all. What is this, a wet floor sign? That can't be good. Oops. Let's put that back up. <laughs> oh no. I'm actually dead. Oh my god, I'm actually dead! <laughs> He's fast on his feet! Was that other girl from before? Why are you also here behind a locked door that I had to unlock to get here? These people are ghosts. They have to be. I, I just happened to be walking by. It's hard to, ex what do you want to know? Why are you asking, why are you asking so many questions, lady? Are you a ghost? It seems like you don't want to talk to me. Didn't I just say, didn't I just ask if you want to know something? Just, uh, this school makes me uncomfortable. It, it does, I'm going to be honest. I was the same as you when I transferred. It doesn't have anything to do with the psycho janitor with the bat? Yeah. She's totally a ghost. She's so dead. They're all dead. I'm alone here. I'm in ghost hell. Everyone's breathing cold air Cause it's cold And it's like fucking It's like 70 outside Okay bye But she's going out there with the janitor I wouldn't go out there with the janitor dude He fucking He, he, he really fucked that guy up Whatever no matter What's this A box of matches don't mind if I do Can be used with F when equipped Lights up surroundings for a limited amount of time why would I ever need to do that? Oh. It's a light switch. Guys, you know this game is gonna get fucked up with the darkness, right? Because of the light switch thing? You do know that they are going to, like, fucking jump scare us with the light switch. 
the darkness in this game is like fucking overwhelmingly dark when it's dark. You know what I mean? Oh, and remember the real difficulty made it even darker? It's a power box. Wait, what? The power is on for this area. Okay, so the air, each area has like their... Guys, I thought that fucking... Oh, I thought this like fucking lamp or whatever. This like clock was a person staring at me. I actually got like, I got spooked. Hang on, we got a compass. I got a compass. How big? All right, is this building that big that I'm going to need a compass for it? Oh no. A note. Impossible maths problem. Nahai was a very normal and average student. So normal that sometimes she would be bullied and teased for it. <laughs> Look at how normal you are. Why are you so, <laughs> why are you so normal? <laughs> why can't you do something ridiculous like glue eating Gary over there? Why can't you just eat glue like Gary? Do something wacky. Do something, make me laugh. Make us laugh. Come on, lady. Maths was the only subject she was below average in, and though she studied and worked as hard as she could, her grades never improved. Whenever she was called to the chalkboard to solve... What the fuck is that fucking sound? What the fuck is that fucking sound? Get the fuck out of here. I'm going back all the way back to the beginning. Yeah, <laughs> you see what I was fucking talking about? The, the visuals have aged very poorly, but the audio design in this game is actually fucking unbelievably good. It is fucked. We're gonna read the note from this toilet. One day, Nahai I had maths for her last period. Unfortunately for her, she got called to the chalkboard to solve math problems. As every time before, she couldn't solve it. The math teacher grew impatient and angry with her. So he told her she could not leave school until she had solved the problem. To make matters worse, the bullies walked up to the chalkboard and changed the problem slightly while Nahai was out of the room. When she returned, she became even more confused, upset, and scared. She had heard about rumors and ghost stories that were told around the school and was growing more and more anxious as it got darker. Suddenly, the back door swung open and her bullies came loudly into the classroom. She was so shocked that she suffered a heart attack and collapsed to the floor. Even in death, she can still be seen up at the chalkboard trying to solve the problem she never finished. Weak heart. It was the only thing abnormal about her. No most normal person I ever fucking met. Loser. All right, chat. Well, I ran from that room a little bit early. That might have just been like flavor sound effects for the story, like her drawing on a chalkboard. But um, it scared me. I feel like it scared many people in the, in the chat, which is why I left for your sakes, not mine, for you. So you wouldn't be scared. Look at that render distance. I know, right? Like, you don't get games with rendered... Most horror games are like, oh, yeah, if you can see that far, you'll see the monster coming. This game doesn't fucking care. It just does it anyways. I really respect that. The spooks can hide in the dark. You know? Hold up. Also, I've been told by the walkthrough, which I have open. I'm not using it currently, but it has, like, tips. And it says I shouldn't run almost ever unless I want to die. So, um, just keep in mind, if I'm taking it slow, it's because I'm listening to the guy on the walkthrough who said if I want to die, I'd run. Apparently, that's how the... Dude, that's some anime, all right. Apparently, if you want to die, you do that. Okay, let's just go back to this room. I wonder what that sound was. Can I go in here? Well, now the janitor knows I'm here if he didn't before. Anything in here I should care about? No, not that I can see. 
That sound was so weird. Chat, that like actually, I'm still unsettled by the sound. Like, I, I don't know what the fuck it was. You all, we all heard it, right? The sound? The word metal has been carved into the amulet. I have an amulet that has metal on it. Right here. The spirits have been released from this realm. And thus I have access to the second floor. Okay, this is good. This is this will be good. Yeah, but apparently chat the remake of this game is not as good as this. Like it goes a lot more cartoony. And I think that's a big mistake because this game seems to be nailing the mood. And I don't think they decide to stick with that. It's locked. Well, then the only way to go is this way or up more. Actually, I sort of just got out of the stairwell a little early there. Hang on, let me see if there's anything more up. Floor three. Let's see what floor three is. Okay, never mind. We cannot do... F we are at floor two and that is it. Let's just take it slow. Apparently, audio cues are really important in this game, so... As you could probably tell from the sound effects from before... Yeah, right! Okay. Man, that is dark dark. That's like impossible, impenetrable darkness. What's this? A note. I'm gonna close this door. I don't really want someone to murder me. Well, I slam doors, huh? My guy's a fucking asshole. Another pen to save with. What does this here do? School Ghost Stories 7, Secrets of the Pond. A small pond could be found between the main building and the gym a long time ago. There's a silly rumor going around that the pond was made from a crater back when the area used to be a refugee camp from the war. Apparently, the site was bombed during the Korean War and a group of soldiers were killed when a bomb. I'm leaving again. I think it's whenever you get to a story, but I don't know if the game pauses when I do this. Apparently, the site was bombed during the Korean War, and a group of soldiers were killed when a bomb hit the tent they had been resting. That is not the only rumor about the pond. A story goes that if you prepare a love letter for someone asking them to meet at the pond, you will stay together forever. But if they don't come, the pond will curse you and you will die. When the moon is its brightest, you can see a figure standing from the hallway window looking at the pond. Some say she has some sort of connection to the pond itself. A timid girl named Su Kyung liked an upper grade student named Sang Joon. After a long period of stress, she sent him a letter to meet up at the pond, feeling it would be worth the risk. Psycho. Maniac play. Insane play. However, the letter was misdelivered and Sang Joon never got it. Su Kyung spent the whole night waiting there in the cold. She fell ill and was absent the next day. She decided to be transferred in a desperate attempt to save herself. No one heard anything more about her until a few months later, when Su Kyung's body floated up from under the pond. Why be a psycho? Why do that? Why bother? Why not like do that on the second date? That'd be so easy. Hey, like we really got along well that time. You wanna like go to the meet at the pond next time? For like date number two? Oh yeah, sure, sure, let's go then. That's like insane, that's insane. Anyways, uh, I'm now positive that those sound effects just happened when um, you read a story, so I'm not gonna be scared anymore, chat, I, I promise. No more, no more getting scared, I'm, I'm braver. Wow, it is dark in these rooms. Okay, this is a, uh, some kind of a uh, tech room for the in-school, like, radio channel or whatever. What time is it? Oh my god. I heard him again. That wasn't the... it. 
Okay. I'm not going in there. Wait! No, I am going to go in there. But I'm going to go in there with a match. I want to see what's in there. I'm going to use a match. Okay, be brave. Where's my matches? Equipment. Nothing. It was nothing. This was a waste of my match. I was like, I was just wondering if there was anything in there. Oh, I hate it. If there is someone there, they got me now. I'm in a corner. Just go away, man! I ain't playing around! Uh... Right if there is someone here, he's on the other side of the fucking door! Just don't look up. Why would you say that? You knew I would- <laughs> <laughs> What just happened to me? What is that? I just got stabbed by a ghost, I think. I feel better. What happened? I don't know. I saw like a fucking frame of something and it scared the fuck out of me. I actually scared that actually like my heart. My heart feels like the heart in this game just sounded like I actually fucking got me pretty bad. Just don't look up. Chad, that's like a normal thing someone fucking says in any situation. Just don't look up, dude. Don't look behind you. Don't look behind you. Don't look up. Don't look down. But it didn't even hurt me. I'm still good. Got a lot of I drink a lot of drink a lot of uh, calcium, chat. Okay. So if I hear that, I just don't look up and I'm okay? Or do I not look forward and I'm okay? Don't answer, I wanna figure it out on my own. Man, that ghost has been really pissing me off though. They've come by a lot. Chat, this game, this game to me is extremely scary. This might be one of the scarier games I've streamed in a long fucking time. By sound effects and music alone, this game is nailing it more than half the horror games I've ever played. Like, the amount of just suspense of the audio and shit is so fucked. And I haven't even seen that janitor. <laughs> I thought it would be easing me into ghosts, but the janitor play happened pretty fucking quick. And I haven't seen him since. How do I turn on the lights in this hallway? I can't see it properly, it's too dark. Nice effect that I can't see things properly in the dark. That's pretty good attention to detail that my character says that. Most games don't even bother doing that. Hope the audio balance has been good, by the way. I'm trying to keep it loud, but not too loud. I want you guys to be able to hear the things happening. I think that's a bu I think I just kicked a bucket in the in the darkness. I think I actually saw that and I forgot it was there. I'm okay. <laughs> yeah, there's a bucket. There's a bucket. I see it now. Hang on, I'm actually gonna move it. <laughs> we're, we're gonna move it. <laughs> I'm moving the bucket. We're gonna get the fuck out of here. We're gonna, I'm gonna move this thing. I can't move it. I, I'm not. <laughs> I can't move it. I just kick it. I'm leaving. <laughs> I thought I could move it. It's everything's locked in this hallway. We're leaving. <laughs> bathrooms you can save in bathrooms. I can tell like the safer zones of the game. Hang on. I'm 
closing this fucking door. No, 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 we're closing. I don't like that hallway at all. I hate it. I really don't like that hallway. Just... This was the hallway that this was the stairwell the janitor took. You think it connects back? You think I can take it down to the first floor as a shortcut? Because that would be so fucking... I don't even want to know yet. Hang on. I just want to make sure that I didn't, like, spawn the janitor to get me now because of that. I might leave this hallway open, actually, because it lets me see if the janitor's coming. If he is even real at all. Okay. Okay, that's a cursed hall. I don't like that one. Oh, another save point up here. Okay, perfect. I am going to save. In a, in a second. I'm gonna save right now. What am I talking about? I have like a thousand save things. First, I'm gonna check these stalls. I wanna make sure there's no demons in them. No demons. No demons. Oh, chat, by the way, if it looks like I'm like dashing for some reason, if you double tap W, it pull, it launches you forward. It like starts run as well. That's just like a little quirk of the controls. So like, I'm not actually trying to run. Sometimes I'm like, I'm just tapping the W button by accident and it's moving him in a sprint. Just so you know, if that eventually gets me caught, it works like Minecraft. I'm saving. I'm gonna save. And apparently I do want to save in multiple slots in this game because this game's got multiple endings and stuff. So, uh, yeah. I keep checking that hallway because I dread it. I just dread it. I dread it. Fuck, man. The suspense in this game, I was like, okay, when the alarm thing was happening, that was nothing. The janitor felt goofy to me and I thought it was sort of funny. Second floor fucked me up so bad, I'm actually, like, not good and you can get soft lo soft locked oh that sounds like fun i can't wait i mean if i get soft locked i'll try the game on real difficulty or something fucked up where's a light switch don't do it ah! boo oh I, uh, I didn't like that i knew it was i knew something bad was coming this time bugs did i hear something or was that the sound of my own voice groaning like from the thought of playing the game Hang on, I heard like a. But I don't know if that was a sound. That sound of me doing it or not. Was that chat? Did I make like a sound, or was that the game making it? Ooh, sound? Close that door, chat. I'm closing it. I'm sealing myself in the room. Is that what you want? Why am I doing this? <laughs> For money? For fame? I do not know. Chat, if a monster came in right now, you know how fast I can open this door? Wow, dude. I definitely get away. Oh, oh. oh it, was a, it was the doorknob. Oh, by the way, the doorknobs in this school for the toilets are wild. <laughs> These are circular doorknobs with clearly lock, like, things for keys in them. Don't... Okay, epic. Don't! Okay, epic. Don't, 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 don't. Okay, cool. Don't fuck it. Okay. Okay. Wait, I can I can rummage through trash, I think. Not in this trash. Okay. Well, chat, this bathroom has been secured. You can call me a hero if you'd like. I'm the man who protects the bathrooms in the school from ghosts, poltergeists, etc. I'm a, I, I go by many names. You can call me Tomato Gaming. Savior of the people. Anything in here? I feel like I'm gonna throw up. I don't know why, because nothing scary's happened in a little bit. Can I? Guys, that, I feel like I keep saying it. That fucking ghost, when you guys told me to not look up, 
scared me so bad I actually was like shaking for like a little like a couple of minutes. Like, I'm still not feeling very good. Just cause like I just cause like nothing happened when I looked up and I was like, yeah, you were goofing. It's a sound effect after all, like I told you. And then it got me seconds afterwards. Oh no. <clears throat> Go pee. I'm not gonna take a pee break yet. Those are precious to me. <laughs> Mr. Lee, where are you? If you're reading this, meet me at the new building. I hid in the main building's ma I hid the main building's master key on the registering room door, door frame. Okay. Okay. All right, let's take a look around. This can't be any worse than the last one. Locked. You have a good day. You have a good day now. <laughs> Got nothing for you. You also have a good day. Don't look up. Don't do anything. Don't move. Stop running. Why are you? Why are you running? <laughs> stop that. Stop that. Stop this. Stop that. Fuck you guys, Chad. I can't do anything. I can't breathe. <laughs> look at a corner. Just tear the corner till you die. Please, Torino. Please. Don't do anything. Quit the game. We're going to crying girl. We have to be men. I'm gonna, I gotta get that my tech deck. <laughs> the teacher still has it. We don't leave till I find it. No matter what happens, we in it for keeps, chat. Keep it, I don't even want it anymore. I'm done with tech deck. I'm getting back into gaming. I like gaming now and mighty beans. I like mighty beans now. I like mighty beans. Oh. She's dead. Oh. Ah, this is a cutscene. I can't move. Hey, can we go? Oh, she despawned. She's gone. It's just a spirit. It was a vision. I have to pee so fucking bad now. I know I just said I didn't have to, but now I sort of gotta. You know what I mean, chat? You ever have that? And what better place than in this spooky hall with motion sensing lights? You know what I mean? To go pee. I'm not pausing the fucking game, chat. I'm gonna leave you here, staring down this hallway, while I go to the bathroom. I'll be right back. I'm back. Nothing happened. It's locked. Well, chat, looks like nothing happened after all. 
So we can move on. Don't look up. Chad, I can't live my whole life without looking up, okay? That's no way to live. You can't live like that. Noise. What? I, I said noise and then there was a noise. Then there was a, I was ignoring you and then I heard a noise right there when you said noise. Second afterwards, the second I said noise. So now I don't know if there's actually a noise. Just ignore it. It's noises all the time. Who closed that hallway door? Which, who, who's the asshole that closed this fucking door? It's how I know if something's coming. Oh, I, I closed it. I closed it because there's a spooky girl at the end of the hall that keeps looking at me. Yeah, we're going to leave that closed. Fuck that. No, 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 no. We're not going anywhere near that. I'm not touching that with a 10-foot pole. We're going into the janitor. I'd rather fuck with the janitor. We're going down on the bottom floor. I'm going to see if that opens a shortcut. Umbral Wind, thanks for the fucking gifted subs, man. Whole, whole five, thank you very much. It's really nice of you. Thank you very much, man. Really kind. Really kind. Lots of people donating money to Wizard Malazar with $10. The Scotch Tape Demon is coming for you, Tomato. Looks like you're in a pretty sticky situation. Monka W. Yeah. $20 from Happy Martin. The idea of real mode reminds me of a classic adventure game called Titanic Adventure Out of Time. That also uses a kind of real time limits near the end of that game, but less crungy. <laughs> fascinating, fascinating. And then... <laughs> I'm not stalling. Shepard Free, thanks for the $10. I'm never giving you that email. You just got scammed. Is this open? Yes. Nothing bad ever happened on the first floor. <laughs> We're back in the safe zone, chat. Is that girl still here or did she leave? She left. Fine by me. Nothing bad. <laughs> oh, that's just, the, that's, that, that's, that, 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 that's just that thing. Nothing bad happens here. We're, we're, that is... Proven. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, do you think he knows? <laughs> this is a dead end. I know it's a fucking dead end. I don't see places to hide in this fucking game. the weirdo girl at the end of the hall. I prefer that over janitor, I think. And I don't know anything else I can do right now. So we're gonna go do that. This spook game? Yeah, kind of a spook game. If I had to tell you what kind of game this was, I'd say it Sort of lands on the spook meter. Not too scary, though. Honestly, you could kick it up a notch and it wouldn't be that bad. Save? I haven't really done anything new.
I have another thing to invent. I don't want to go near her yet. <laughs> That's gonna happen a lot. <laughs> That's gonna happen many times. <laughs> I don't trust anything, chat. Like, that feels like a trick. It feels like I do that and I get got. So instead, I'm going to go over to the dark corner this lady was in and take a look around over there. You know? Do I have infinite matches? Or, like, a matchbook? How many matches I got? I still have them. Chat. I know not many people have played this fucking game. But I used one already and I still have the item. Does this just technically work forever? It just goes out after a certain point in time? Because, like, I'd like to use it again. Technically, yes. I want to check this corner. That had a ghost in it. I can investigate this. Oh, no. What am I doing? Why am I doing this? Do I want to? Do I even want to? Why would I? Why would I investigate a window? What would matter? There's nothing here. Don't. Nothing bad ever happens to Tomato Gaming. I'm too smart. Bitch. See you later. I'm stealthing away. Get stealthed on. Get actually stealth done. Get fucking actually like Omega owned, you know? That's sort of what it comes. Omega owned. Fucking actually destroyed by me. Thank you, Sergeant Rorschach, for the gifted subs, man. Okay. All right, so what do I, I don't really want to go over there again. Hang on, I know I haven't done much since last time, but I'm going to not, I'm not saving small pit stop in the bathroom. I think we've earned like a 10 second little pit stop in the toilets. All right, so kick back in the toilets. We've earned like a little fucking pit stop in the toilets for a minute, just a little breather. Cause that was actually fucked up as hell. Stalling, he's stalling, Are you, you're stalling. Okay? Yes, darling. Should I go back? Hang on. I, I almost feel like I was supposed to do that before I went into the weird hallway with the lights. I think I have to go back again. I know. I know. I know. What was that? 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 There was something in the window. There was a light and I saw a light go by. Was that a light or was that a person? I want someone to clip it! <laughs> you ruined that ghost's entrance. Oh no, what will I do? Oh no, oh, too bad. I really feel bad for them. <laughs> oh dang, dude. Dang. Oh frick. Ah, oh, dang, now they won't be able to spook me as hard. <laughs> oh man, I didn't want to ruin their big entrance. I need someone to confirm that light. Okay, there it is. I, I see something. I see it. I, 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 I. All right. I, I, I. Check for myself. Okay, no, I'm just a psycho. Okay, chat, what happened was my the hand of the game lit up on the interaction thing. And I thought that was a light outside because I'm that insane right now. That's how much that's how much of my like fucking sanity has dwindled. I'm at like negative I'm at like I'm very close to heart attack in darkest dungeon levels of sanity right now. And that's why I'm gonna peel around this corner and hope that ghost is gone. I'm actually gonna look in that direction, but with my eyes closed. No, I'm not gonna do that. That'd be even scarier. I'm gonna just walk. Hey, do I like need to, are you okay? I feel like I actually did mess something up. Ah! 
Okay. Wow, that was ruined. <laughs> Fuck her, chat, all right? <laughs> you think I care? Okay, so this is still locked. Okay. I <laughs> just wanted to make sure I wasn't... Should I, I, should pro chat, I should probably reload for the sake of being sure that I didn't, like, bug out this enemy. I mean, it despawned. It should be fine. Stop running! Don't run, don't run, don't stop running. Just don't look up, don't look down, just stop running. I'll show you fucking running. for my tech deck. I'm looking, uh, my, the teacher confiscated my tech deck. So I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm actually just looking for it. I need to get that back. I got, like, the glove. The glove makes my tech deck look, my hand make look, look like a human, like a human body, and I don't want to get back into my, uh, tech decking, so I need that, I need that, that tech deck back. I think this is actually the classroom. I came to return your diary. I went for a walk. I was going to give someone white day candy. I have no- all these- I went for a walk sounds like I'm a psycho murderer. And if I say that I have her diary, she's going to think I'm a maniac and an asshole. So I think I just say that I'm giving someone white day candy and it could be anyone. And she won't care and then I can stealthily return the diary. On my own time. What? She got like angry! You came to school because of that?! Oh, she's being killed now. It's over. She's dead. It's over. <laughs> well, it's not my fault. Anyways. Bye. Oh, it's really messed up in there. What the hell? Should I, like, look? Yeah, I don't think I can get in there. Who's laughing? It's not funny. <laughs> It isn't funny what is happening. You need to stop laughing. Uh, I don't. I think I'm gonna get hurt if I walk in. So I'm not walking in. I don't know how to help you. I'm looking for like interactive stuff in the environment. This picture seems very vulgar. Yeah, it is sort of vulgar. Ow! Ah! Okay, don't go in there. I got slapped. His face is on the floor. That one looks like he's happy. <laughs> hey, man. Sorry about Tree Guy. He's sort of an asshole. The rest of us are cool, though. Okay. Uh. Well, um. She's in 2 8. Not really much I can do about that. Ow! Ow! I'm out the window? Okay. I don't know what to do to help her. Chat, she's like gonna die. I don't know what to. I can't get in there. They'll kill me. Ow! They're... Matter of fact, they're killing me through the fucking window. Ow! 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 I can't help you, lady. Not really much I can do here. I think she's gonna die, Chat. I uh, I'm getting slapped from the outside. I just close the door back? Yeah, we'll just close the door again. I'm dying. I might die, which might be for the best because I can make sure that that rope, that, 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 uh, ghost spawns properly this time. I'm slow now. You can't even fight a tree, this guy. What do you want from me?
I don't know what you want from me, chat. I can't just magically fucking... I can't just fucking magically beat this tree. I can barely walk right now. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to do. I was thinking maybe I could like, climb into a window or something, but I cannot. Just use your chainsaw. I'm gonna run for it. Hey, I got an idea. I have an idea. I have an idea. I'm gonna drink this coffee. Okay, I'm gonna drink this soybean milk. I'm gonna save her. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, we can't, uh... We aren't gonna be able to save her like this. This is, um, that's not a, that is not a gamer move. They're laughing at me. They were laughing. They left. That's fine. We'll be okay. All I have to do is grab the coin again. Activate spooky girl. I think I can skip that cutscene even. And then the rest is piece of cake easy. The coin's right in here. Ah. Laughing your inadequacy. Chad, I have to be honest with you, okay? I have been... I have been urged to follow the walkthrough to some extent, like as a guideline to play because of the fact you can get soft locked apparently in this game. And I was apparently, what I was doing was I was looking for an in, like a inspection point. Cause apparently I'm supposed to inspect part of a window over there when she gets grabbed. And I couldn't find it. That was what was happening. I was, I was following, it was saying to inspect a window, but it wasn't appearing for me. Like a lot of the game is a little bit like weird and requires you to like, like that ghost only spawns if you inspect a window here, like this one. Like there's all sorts of weird stuff, you know? So I sort of need to be following the walkthrough just to like not miss horrible, tiny, obscure things. You know what I mean? You're gonna have to watch this girl do it again though. Again. And this time I won't crouch and I'll let her scare me properly. Okay. So now I walk up to this. There's nothing here. I turn around. She spooks me and then disappears. Okay. Now according to the walk to him, I'm supposed to go over here first. Which I didn't, which I fucked up the order of because I'm not trying to follow it that close. I just want to, you know, this time I want to do it by the books so it doesn't fuck up if there was something that, I'm dead. I'm dead. Thirty-four. Hop, hop, hike. <laughs> now I just activate the cutscene. Down the hall, they won't be able to stop me. Get closed on. <laughs> well, he knows where I'm going. I lost him. And he's slow. Okay, then blah, 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 she's gonna talk to me. I'm gonna say I'm still in school because, well, last time it said, I went for a walk. All right, they're all bad options. All right, then she gets grabbed. The monster starts attacking, and it says I'm supposed to investigate a window from this floor that's gonna let me unlock all the other doors in this wing, but I can't, I can't inspect any of the windows here. So maybe I don't actually need to and the, the walkthrough is a little bit off. Because I definitely don't have any windows to interact with in 2-8. None here. Not this one either. You just missed it. No, this is the this is a picture. See? I didn't I didn't miss it. It's not actually anything. BDI streamer. It just doesn't happen. It doesn't work. So I don't think I'm supposed to do this yet. I think that the, because the walk, look, the walkthrough says, all right, 
All right. Examine the window of the infected classroom 28 from the second floor hallway. All of the other classrooms in this hallway can now be unlocked. Do so. Unless it means, like, one of the windows in the back. And I can somehow examine it from here. Window above the door. Are you sure? This side? I'm not getting anything on either of those. I see something inside, but I can't interact with it. Stop looking up. No, 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 chat. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You guys are crazy. You guys have lost your goddamn minds, and I'm joining you. The laughing is still happening. Uh, I'm gonna take a look around, and she'll be fine. To the right of the tree room. Maybe the walkthrough lied? It's the only walkthrough that exists, chat. So if it's lying, we are on our own, brother. All right, we have nothing. If it's lying, we have nothing. Do you understand? It said I was supposed to investigate it from the hallway. So it should be something I can reach even from here. Regardless. This is all we have. It says I need to investigate a window. I don't want to go in and I just get slapped and then it starts slapping me from outside the building. It starts slapping me from the hallway. I see that thing. It's, it's one of the emblems to open one of the things, but I can't grab it. It kills me so fast. Right. The only thing to the right is these windows, which are from 2-7. A different... to the right of that door. That's the person's mouth. Sorry, you guys are maniacs. I, I don't know why I ever bought any of this shit. I'm gonna take a look around. We'll be back for you. We'll be, I'll be back. We'll be back for her. Don't worry, chat. Yeah, that's a painting, chat. You guys have lost your minds. The game's not broken. It's just, it's very, it's got some weird, obscure puzzle shit from like 2001. Man, that person's really laughing it up over there. They, they think they're fucking funny, you know what I mean? They think they're fucking funny and they're gonna laugh forever until I figure out what the f solution is to this. And that girl is probably dead by now, but there's not really much I can do about that. Light switch, maybe? I don't think there was a light switch in there. The, the fucking chat. All right, here's the only thing you can do to help me, and that's look up a playthrough on YouTube and find this part and tell me how they did it. Because that's, like, the only way I, I will be, like, because I think the walkthrough might be right. It's just not explaining it very clearly. Because, like, there's nothing floor under the tree. That's just the floor. Can't get in any deeper than this without getting attacked. The light's broken. You missed an item needed from floor three. I never went on floor three. There's no point in this entire game so far that I've been on floor three. Apparently you can unlock the lock at 27. No. No, no. The best I can do is backtrack to the rooms I can open and check like the lockers and stuff there, which I guess I'll do now. But there is a locker in, in the building. Save so young. Okay. The player needs two items, insect repellent and chemi chemical solvent. You guys are probably, chat, here's the thing. You guys are looking up walkthroughs from the new game, which is not the same game. The only way that you're gonna find- I've got the only walkthrough for the game open. Okay? The only one that exists. Alright. In order to actually find what I need to do, you'd have to go onto a YouTube video. Essentially. Will you stop laughing? It's not that funny! Stop laughing! It's not funny. Wait, I saw something. Another save pen. I guess I should save 
And then I'll have more- then I can look around from there. Might be best to go to the first floor, the tree's in another room. There's another tree? On the first floor? Okay. Okay, you were right. There's mosquitoes in the classroom. It's also locked. Locked from the other side. Ah, oh, well, that girl's still in a lot of trouble. There's not really much I can do about that. Mosquitoes in the classroom. Man, it's a mess in there! Rather odd atmosphere for a picture. Uh, man, that tree's fucking funny, is the thing. I mean, these lights... I'm, I don't know if the janitor's gonna be coming soon, chat, which is sort of freaking me out. Checking all the doors. I have to watch a Jacksepticeye playthrough for you, tomato. Do it. Do whatever it takes. Do whatever it takes. You can open desk drawers, someone said. I don't believe I can. I think I can open some lockers, though. Technically. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Lunchbox. Mine. Give it to me. God, it's fucking funny. You will need to restart the encounter with the hanging ghost girl. You will receive the key that will unlock the doors. But I did restart it. Did I not pick up the item? Did she drop an item I was supposed to get before? Because I did restart it. Was it on the floor in there? I can go check. Oh, I didn't unlock it this time. Fuck. There was a light switch there. Why does it matter if there's a light switch here, chat? This isn't the floor I'm, I'm like, doing stuff for. Go to the room you found the matches. Okay, that's this room. Right here. Where there is a photocopier. Can I open some of these lockers, maybe? Anything? It's a stepping stool. Oh, really? No! No! <laughs> this is why we need a walkthrough. You guys are allowed to help me in this game. You are flat out allowed to. If you have the actual answers, feel free. Because this game's doing like fucking harvester level, like, hunting for items. You read that in a note from the guy on the wall. I see. Chat, is the laughing ever gonna stop or did I sequence break it by accident and now I should like reload and do it one more time now that I have the key properly? The laughing will stop. It will never stop. Oh. Oh. Don't worry guys, I'll th the laughing is gonna go away eventually, I promise. We'll, we'll find a way to make it stop. It's gonna stop being funny. They'll stop thinking it's funny after a little bit, I promise. Don't worry. We just gotta kill that. We just gotta save her from the tree. Okay. We just gotta look around for some things. It's gonna stop being funny. Oh wait, this is that. This is what that gym thing was talking about with the books. I mean the uh, balls. Nothing in here. I mean, if there's an enemy after me. I won't be able to find them. Because I'm surrounded by just like a billion monsters. Like there's so much laughing. And it's not even that funny. Honestly, it's not very funny. Bottom right locker, you mix. All right, chat, here's the difference. Okay, I don't want you guys to tell me if I missed something. I want you to tell me if I need something. Like if there's nothing, in, like I, a locker can be investigatable, but if it's just got soybean milk in it, I don't fucking care. <laughs> That's where I don't care anymore. It all I had was soybeans. I just want the laughing to stop. Make the laughing. It's not even that funny. Stop laughing. Stop laughing. Stop laughing. 
reload that laughing is so annoying. I don't know if it'll fix if I reload or not. It might not even worth, like, change anything. Eh. But it is actually getting funny again. It won't. Laughing stays even if you reload. It's an event. Okay. So I have to just make her... I have to save her and the laughing will stop. I can do that. I can do that. I can handle a little bit of laughing. I can I can handle that. It's actually getting funny again. It's getting funnier. Uh... Try to, yeah, it's definitely getting, it's getting funny again. I wasn't sure for a minute, but now I am, again. It's coming back. <laughs> you know, it actually, it's actually like, it sort of makes me happy that they're enjoying it so much over there, you know? Hey, at least we can check all the classrooms now. Okay. Open this up. Plenty of classrooms to open. One of these will have what we need to save her, I'm sure. Like a sort of... Oh. I'm guessing this is a picture of the devs. What's this? First aid kit. Taking it. School Mountaineering Club. I see. Just hanging out, having a good time. Note on the ground. I don't have time to read the scary stories. We'll read it later. That always spawns that spooky ghost with the sound effects. Insect repellent. We can use that on the insect one. We got the insect repellent. That was one of the things we needed. Okay, we keep exploring. We keep going. Strange picture of someone asleep. That's good, that's good, I like that. Soy milk, again. There's so many sound effects, I don't know. I don't know if I'm under attack anymore because someone keeps laughing. It's not funny! Stop laughing! It's like you guys when you fucking say like streamlet and stuff and then laugh it up. It's not that funny anymore. It's locked firmly. I need to unlock this thing. Uh, keep in mind that that desk is locked. What's this? Announcement to all students and staff. The sports equipment is not being returned to the storage rooms after class. Okay. Please tell the head of PE if you find any missing equipment, especially any balls. It's a note. B class 12 balls. Wait, class 12 ball practice, class 4 ball practice. The equipment have not been cleaned thoroughly after lessons. Okay. I see. Stop it, chat. You don't have to laugh with them. It's not even that funny. Safe unlock code. Turn left to the number of baseballs. Turn right to the number of volleyballs. Turn left to the number... Oh my god. Turn left to the number of footballs and turn right to the number of basketballs. God? God? Hang on. Pause the game. Mute the game. God? Please. God in heaven. Chat this bot, whatever's in this fucking safe is probably the item we need to make the laughing stop. Okay? We need whatever's in here to stop the fucking laughing. Because I want it to end. The laughing gotta end. It is truly horror. <laughs> we have to fucking solve this puzzle. Now, what do we remember? Apparently... We are turning to the number of basketballs and different balls in the classrooms. Those are how they did it. Remember, we found two balls in one of the classrooms, okay? We have to actually tally all of the balls in all of the classrooms, okay? Okay? I, I, I'm saying that because I just did do a quick once-over of the walkthrough, and it's... Quiet as fucking death regarding the just instant combo for me, you know? Five left, four right, seven left, three right. <laughs> You're a lifesaver, man. You okay? You're I'm in a V I'm in a VIP that guy. 
<laughs> if it works. <laughs> Five left, four right, seven left, three right. Thanks. You are right, man. Oh my god. Okay. We have to start. All right. It's like cursed level. This is like cursed level. Five left, four right, seven left, three right. Five left. One, two, three, four, five. Four right. One, two, three, four. Seven left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Three right. One, two, three. That guy's banned forever. Or I fucked it up. Did it wrong. How did I do it wrong? <laughs> Help me, man. <laughs> Seven in number. Oh, fuck. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. That is how safe work. Seven. Four. Say it again. Say the numbers again, chat. Help me. Help me. Help me, please. Five four seven three. It's five four seven three or seven four six seven. Oh my god. Five four people are oh my god. People are saying it's five four seven three. Oh my god. Start from zero. Five. Four. Seven. Three. That was not it. And I think I did it right that time. <laughs> I think that time I actually did it correct. Five, four, seven, three. The code is randomly generated. No. No, 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 no. You can't be. You can't. That's fucked up. No, that, that can't be true. This is a game from 2001. Like, it can't do that. It fucking literally can't do that. There are three baseballs in the basket. There's one. There's a volleyball in the basket. There's three footballs in the basket. There's five basketballs in the basket. Hang on, this might be easier than I thought. Where's the notes? I can't believe I don't have a cell phone. They'd probably just text me the, the, the hint. Go to the safe and get my rake. Uh, the combination lock is the number of balls in each basket. Okay, this might actually be easier than I thought. Hang on, this might actually be really easy and I'm an idiot. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up, ba 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 Uh... How- where was the note that told me the order? Here it is. Left baseballs, right volleyballs, left footballs, right basketballs. Oh, it actually shows it. So it's three, one, three, five for me. Unless I have to add the ones from the other things that I'm missing. Let's try that first. So I'm going to reset it at zero. Three. One. Three. Five. Yep. Okay. I have to go get the extras. So chat, there's a bunch in like all the other rooms in this building. I find those. And I will. Wow, that's a really fucking angry fucking cabinet. What the fuck did this open so angrily for? I don't understand. We have to find other balls. Chat people, just reload now. There's no chat if I reload I don't lose anything! You fucking moron! I'm shaking you! Nothing changes! The laughing continues! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> it's the actual safe puzzle. I've been avoiding it for years. <laughs> for fucking years. Okay. So there are some classes that still have balls. We picked up a note that talked about which classes have the balls. Because it's the class plans. So class 12, 4, 5, and 7 have balls. They're all grade 12. I believe the second floor is all grade 12. We have to go to 4, 12, 5, and 7. And we will find the balls we're looking for. I need a piece of paper. <laughs> I need a piece of paper. I need a piece of real paper. This isn't real paper. I need real paper. I need actual human paper. Where's, I don't own paper. Where's paper? 
Why don't I own any paper in my house? Should I have to go find paper? Give me a minute. I gotta find paper. <laughs> I found some! It's the instruction booklet for my desk, to build my desk. Here I go. I have to tally how many balls, which kind of balls are in which classroom. Phone? Yeah, right, chat. I got big fucking fat fingers, dude. Okay. I already forgot which classes have no... All right. You can go 12 first. Class 12. Which is this one. These fucking assholes. Wait a minute. Is this, what floor is this? This is, this is floor two. Okay, I just wanna make sure I was on the right floor. All right, class 12 first. What are you hiding? I see the bucks. Oh, I see the bucks. Class 12 is missing a football. One foot ball. 12, one football. Next up is class four on the list. Actually, I'll just probably go in descending order. So next is seven. Sure hope there's none in a uh, tree room. Nine, eight, seven is the far one here. Seven has a volleyball and a basketball. Seven, one, volley, one, Basket. Okay. Next. Class five. I have no idea where the fuck class five is. I've run out of floor. Is it bottom floor? After all? Because I've run out of floor. Already. I'm out of floor. Is it actually like... Is some of it just first floor? And I gotta like deal with janitor now? Because I'll cry. You have to go downstairs, but that is where the janitor lives. And I just got jump scared by clothes. And they're laughing still happening. I, 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 I can't do the laughing is fucking messing up audio. I don't know where things are. At first it was annoying. Now it's actually scary because I can't tell where things are that I need. Someone just like... Oh my god, there's just so much fucking shit happening. I have to move fast. I'm just gonna run. I don't think there's a janitor right now. I think there's like an event. Nothing's coming to hurt me. Nothing can, nothing's hurting me right now. I have to just move. Don't, I don't have time. We'll come back for the notes on this floor. We're just here for the things. All right. This is class. What class was this? Is there a UFO trying to get me? Class five is one basketball. Five. One. Basket. Okay. One more. We gotta go to class seven. Where the fuck is class seven? Chat? Where the fuck is class seven? Because this is class six. Here. Oh, I did seven? I need four. I, need, I did seven, I need four. Okay, <laughs> that makes more sense because I'm like, wait a minute. If seven's all that I have left and I already did everything else, where the fuck is seven? <laughs> Just fucking stop. <laughs> fucking stop. All right. Seven is one football, one basket. We have everything we need. We get back up to the top floor. And then, Tomato Gaming is going to solve the safe puzzle and the crowd will go fucking wild. The crowd is going to go insane. Why are you running? I don't think the janitor exists right now. Like, I actually don't believe he's here because I would have seen him. I don't have that much map unlocked. And I haven't seen him, so I'm guessing he's despawned because of this event. Like, genuinely. And also, I'm gonna open up the shortcut when I get back. Down this hallway. <laughs> Did 
you use tally marks? No, I wrote one football, one basket, idiot. You think I'm an idiot like you? Like, you would do that. I know you would do that, but I won't. I'm smart. Okay, so the new tally for baseballs is the same. There was not one baseball anywhere. So, baseballs is still three. Next up. Volleyball goes from one to a two. Okay. Volleyball goes from one to two. So it's now three, two. Three footballs in here currently. That goes to five. So currently it is three, two, five. Lastly, basketballs, which there are five right now. It goes from three, two, five, and there's uh, one, two, three baskets. Three, two, five, eight is the, la is the new combination. Is three, two, five, eight. And we start on going left. It's weird because, chat, here's the thing, actually, because this is technically, it's technically right, but the arrow says it, so it confused me. I want to go this way. Three, two, five, eight. Okay, apparently that was not it. So I guess we're going to follow the arrows the way that the arrows are saying, even though I don't, I don't understand, dude. Safe puzzles fucking suck. This sucks so bad. I definitely have the number right. I definitely have the number right. I definitely have the number right. So I guess I'll just follow the arrows and turn it technically the way the arrows say. Three. Two. Five. Eight. Yeah, right, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm following arrows. Technically, those aren't the right directions, I don't think. But whatever, it is random. Because I went the opposite direction and it worked. So chat to everyone that was like, he's doing it wrong. No, I just have to follow the arrows the way they quite literally said on the UI for that. But I did it, baby. Tomato Gaming did a safe puzzle. A bottle of acid. Very harmful to humans, plants, and animals. Okay, okay. It is time to save my game. <laughs> it is time to go save. We are saving the game. And then I'm gonna save that girl and the laughing will stop. It'll stop being funny. I swear to fucking God, it's gonna stop being funny. Hang on. St silence. Quiet right there. One moment. I am just making sure I haven't missed anything in the walkthrough because now, chat, I'm following it like it's the Bible. Okay. <laughs> okay, blah, 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 something about soy drink. Do the gym puzzle. I did it. Okay. Unlock the safe. Okay, just like a normal safe. Fuck you. Just like a normal safe puzzle walkthrough piece of shit. This may be different for your game, but the method is always the same. Once you've opened the safe, take the bottle. Go to the infected classroom 2-2 on the first floor. Use the bottle to get into the room. You lose health in there. Be prepared to use some of your food or drink. There are sacks in there with a blue apparition moving between them. Each time the apparition moves to a sack, use a bottle on it and run away to avoid the explosion. Okay. Uh, I think we can just connect the dots from there. I guess I'm going to a boss fight is what's happening. How much food do I have? I have first aid kit. And I have lunches. And soy. We should be okay. Let's roll. To the bottom floor, we're going to 2-2 to throw acid on things. I think. All right, chat, that girl up there, irrelevant. I think what we're actually doing is killing the root of the tree is what's happening right now. Hey, asshole. Oh, there they are. That was the apparition right there. I saw them. Do I need to use the bug repellent first? 
I protected myself from insects. Okay, I poured acid on it. Wait, what? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm pouring acid on it. I think I need to hit the ones that are red while she's in it. Oh, I gotta hit the ones while she's in it. She goes into one. I gotta hit it then. There she is. Okay, they're exploding. They're exploding. That just hurt me a lot. Hang on, she's going into this one. Acid it. Fuck if I know if I'm winning. I don't know if I'm winning. I don't know if I'm winning. Hang on, was it? Hey, blah, 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 Blue apparition moving between them. Each time the apparition moves through a sack, use the bottle on and run away to avoid the explosion. They will all eventually disintegrate. Whatever you say, lady. Or mod walkthrough guy. I can only reach some of them. Or an acid. Okay, so I just get the ones that she moves to when she moves to them. So now I follow her to the other side. But I can't run in this game, so it's a little awkward. Is it this one? Oh yeah, it's that one. Okay, where's she going to next? That one. Now she's in that one. Ow! Okay, I, I'm hurting her, she's screaming. That's good, I'm winning. I'm beating the ghost in her own game. After her. Get acided. I don't know if I'm winning, I don't know what's happening, honestly. This is why I needed to walk through, I'm glad I got one. Get acided. Acided again. Get fucking epic owned. Get acided. Get fucking destroyed. She's going to that one. She's going to the far end. Get owned. I, uh, I'm not really sure if I'm winning or not, though. Like, she did a scream one time. Did I get one of the sacks? Did there used to be another sack there? I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be spamming until it explodes or what? Ow. I think she walked into me. Oh, I got that one. Fuck you. Yeah, you're running out places to hide, girl. I'm winning. Chad, I'm really winning. Ow. Okay, I'm getting hurt, but that's okay. She's getting hurt worse. I got another. We're killing it. We're gonna win. We're gonna save her. We're saving my friend. Chad, I'm really gonna make the laughing stop. I told you I would do it and none of you bought it. None of you believed it. You all said tomatoes are hack fraud. But look at me now. Pouring acid on trees to make them die so I can save my friend or whatever. End of the line, ghost. You all out of options now, that's the last sack. Easy! It's not funny, is it? It's not funny anymore. Alright, so, chat, this, it's going to be so quiet now. Honestly, I didn't hate that sequence. I actually thought that, it felt like the laughing was a little annoying, but I didn't hate that sequence in general. It was a nice, this game's got, it was actually a nice distraction from the suffocating atmosphere of this game normally, right? And now we get to go back to suffocating atmosphere where I can barely breathe. Atmosphere that's so quiet. This is just what it's always like again. Well, let's get back upstairs. We gotta go talk to that girl and tell her we saved her. I should also drink some soy milk. Oh my God, the game does not pause when you do this. I now know that. That's good to know. That means it never paused when I was in. It actually doesn't pause when you're in notes either. That's really good. That means I'm never safe when I read. I still have a horror story to read. Hang on, I do know, I gotta go save. So I'm just gonna walk, talk to the girl, then save, okay? Hopefully the janitor's not back yet. I mean, then again, the janitor's not that scary. The other monsters are much scarier. Hey, girl, you alive now? 
You good? Did I save your life? Hello? She's actually fucked off. Or she's dead in there. Hang on, I'll be the judge of that. I'll be the judge of that. You dead? She dropped an emblem. It's an amulet. A wood amulet. Chad, I'm probably gonna beat this game on stream, dude. I'm really enjoying this. I mean, if I can fucking follow the walkthrough, that is. If I get gatekept by the walkthrough, that'll be a different story. But I do want to see it through to as far as I can get before I get, like, soft-locked. It's like 40 hours. No, it isn't. <laughs> Let me just save. Then we can go from there. I didn't loot much of the bottom floor, so I need to do that still. Or the top floor. Didn't really loot any of the rooms. So I should probably go do that. Either way, I'm going to save. It feels earned. Okay. So. Now we can, I guess, go and explore and do whatever we want. Because we got that seal. So we're going to head back over to the stairwell because I know where the seal goes. But I'm probably going to do some looting while I'm here. I don't think the janitor's around, which is why I'm running. I don't think the janitor is here. Because he's a... He's afraid of me. Because he saw me do my, that football play, and I ran right by him, and it made him feel like he was old and weak. So he stopped chasing me. He's probably going home now because he's, like, scared of how fast I am. In a, in a, in a straight sprint, you know? I'd be scared if I were him, too. Can I turn on these lights? Let's get lights on in this hallway. That'll make this place seem a little bit less, uh... You will never scare me again, not with this light! Okay, the light actually doesn't reach there, but whatever. I, it's almost there. It's a note. Oh, no. The dormitory spirit. Why high was a girl's... Was a new girl's school tucked away at the bottom of a very remote mountain? There were very few houses built nearby, so not many people attended. Dormitory C's superintendent was known as the Tiger. She was well known for her refined bearing and for being ruthlessly strict. Both traits she inherited from her rich, old-fashioned family. This attitude made her very unpopular with the girls of her dormitory, who were always complaining about her. Not long after the start of the school's second term, the second-year student fell from a window at the third floor and broke her neck. She'd been playing... She'd been playing truant after an exam, trying to avoid being caught by the superintendent. Soon after, there were rumors going around that the tiger had driven her to suicide. Some rumors even claimed that she had killed the girl herself. The superintendent was very shocked and upset by the rumors, and became much more subdued. The girls of her dormitory had their revenge, and they were very pleased. The following evening, another girl was punished after walking outside of curfew. The superintendent had her ponytail cut off. The girl was outraged at the loss of her beautiful blonde ponytail and stormed out of the room. The following morning, she too was found dead. Years after the superintendent had died, people saw her appear in dormitory C's corridors. The dormitory was subsequently closed, but this did not stop her from appearing, and she still haunts the place to this day. We also have another story that I picked up. The Strange Tree. He Jin, a grade 2 student, was suspended from school for fighting. She felt guilty about what she did and often ran from home. In grade 3, during the spring semester, she returned. She was very cautious now, but generally seemed quite normal. The only odd thing about her was the way she carried a flower pot around. She always took special care of it and shouted at people who got too close. One day, someone accidentally dropped a chemical into the flower pot during an experiment in class. Her flower withered and she went hysterical. The class went silent. A horrendous stench filled the atmosphere as her body thinned and contracted like a flower stem. There was no obvious source of the smell, so the chemistry teacher tried to throw the flower pot out. He just went into a demented rage, screaming, I'll kill anyone who touches it! No one wanted any trouble, so they left her with it. Later that night, the school janitor, Yi Bong Gu, was on his patrols. While passing the science rooms, something caught his eye. At the end of the hallway, there stood a figure of a girl with her back to him. He carefully walked over to her and called several times. She began to turn, the moonlight shining from behind her, and gazed at him with bloodied clothes. He held a pot of blood in one hand and a dog in the other. He ran from her, realizing that the... Realizing 
that he disposed of that dog during other patrols. A week later, He Jin was later found dead in the toilets. I see. I think there's a ghost gonna stab me if I look up right now. You think a ghost gonna get me if I look up? It's usually how it goes. Just probably just won't look up. You're gonna act like a dog for the rest of the fucking stream. Never look up. Ever. I live on the ground floor. And this is the broken room. Yep. Where the tree was. I'm just turning on all the lights because I like lights. I like lights. Okay, never mind. This one's also broken. That's fine. That's fine. All right, chat. We're going to keep on moving on. Janitor hasn't been around in some fucking time. Probably because he's scared, like I said, like I said. Don't be a piece of cake. We I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? Why am I doing? What am I doing? Why am I going in here again? Leave, 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 leave. Oh, it's her again. No, no, Monga, I did. Monga, she's the only one that, like, oh, these people all have cold breath, but I don't. You know what I mean? I don't know anything. I don't. Uh, listen, lady. Chat, here's the thing. I don't want to freak you out, but this walkthrough has guides for the dialogue. Okay? And I'm not using that shit. But it keeps saying, pick a response, and then it says in parentheses in all caps, to be safe. At some point. So... <laughs> I don't listen, lady. I don't know anything. Please, calm down. Why are you here? It's like 11 p.m. I want to give someone white day candy. I'm not really here for my tech deck, okay? I, I, I actually... I, God, I'm lonely. Yeah. Yeah, so, no, So Young's got nothing to do with this. What do you mean? So Young's got nothing to do with this. He's taking advantage of me. Are you jealous of me with So Young or something? Why do you suspect So Young? She's not a normal girl. She likes to be alone. Sometimes she mutters to herself. I do that. For a living. <laughs> Chad, stop saying that. Do you hear that? <laughs> the laughing has been replaced with loud crying. Are we dead? Don't give me control now. I'll pause the game. Let me, like, this is a cut. Follow. Follow the crying sound. I waited. We're running. I wanted to vote. I didn't know I was timed. No, 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 no. We're gonna reload. I wanted to do that one. I wanted to follow the crying sound. I'm gonna reload. They just screwed me out of it. Chat, it's not even. Leave me. Stop talking to me. We're skipping this. Shut up. We're, I don't even want to be here. Let me cut you. Chat, I, I had no idea this had time decisions. I need to keep that in mind as we go forward now. I got robbed. I got robbed. We're gonna run there this time, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick, go follow the crying, because I'm curious. And I'm not afraid of ghosts. You guys know this about me. I've said a thousand times, you know one thing I'm not afraid of? 
ghosts. We just, the only thing we lost out of this was I don't have like the fucking lights turned on anymore. Who cares? I didn't even gain any items from that whole thing. This game was the first game to add fucking timed interactions. I don't know anything. Uh, I don't know what you- please calm down. Ba -ba -ba -ba, I wanted to give someone white candy. What do you mean? Why do you suspect so young? And now I'm gonna follow the crying this time. Because I'm deeply curious and I like spooky stuff, you know? Follow the crying sound. I clicked it. I think if it's a red thing, it actually influences- Oh, I made a big mistake! I made a big mistake! Oh. Yo, this worked out! Hey. How you doing? Uh, are you hurt? You were grabbed by a tree and almost killed. Changing the- Are you changing the subject? Oh, okay, no, she's aware. Uh, no, I, everything's locked. Everything's locked. Did I do anything? I picked up some amulet. I, I, I got that tree? I got the tree for her. I saved her life. Oh. <laughs> hey! Listen here, lady! Oh, so it's your fault. Uh, what do we do? What should we do? I'm not gonna ask her what I should do. She's gonna tell me to, like, go fuck off. What should we do? Okay, bye. So, uh... Yeah. Yeah, you have a good day now. <laughs> Alright, chat, we're back to Ghost O'Clock. Uh, we're back to the spooky part of the game, so just as a heads up, if you are having fun, not being scared, um... We're back to the bad part. I have a new amulet to open stuff with, and we're gonna go do that. We're back to the scary part of the game, where I hate it again. We had a nice little detour, which I actually appreciate in my horror games. I like little detours. I think a horror game that's all 100% hyper horror is um a little wacky to me. I think it's... Are you T-posing? That can't be good. I think the game was expecting me to not come this direction. I, I think that's actually, it was expecting me to walk in from the other way and see her and then she disappear. But I saw her from this way and it was a T, you know? Uh, enter main building two. Oh, I thought that was just how dark it was. Okay, we're in a new zone. Main building two. I thought that was just how dark it was. Weird. New act, new me. What? No. Why'd that, why'd the room, why'd the building shake? Oh, the floors creak now. That's good too. Chat, this is very good. I like this place. It's a map. A map? Yo! I got jump scared by the by the by the fucking map scrolling. This is good shit. I like having a map very much. It's a note. I've experienced various types of phenomena in the music room, but the most common is the piano. Every rainy night, the piano is played without an audience to hear it. Another event is the music player in the music equipment room randomly turning on and off. It was originally in the music room itself, but since it began malfunctioning, it was left on top of one of the bookcases in the music equipment room, where it is now kept. Some people think its odd behavior is somehow caused by the old music teacher who killed herself long ago. You guys, I'm back to being, like, scared of my own fucking shadow again. The mood changed from going to, like, going from a zone I felt like I had conquered to some extent to this place is not 
Lost on me. I don't like being here again. Okay, so I can't get into the principal's office because he's got a padlock. Well, Hello? Who is it? You have the wrong number. What was that, a baby? Babies can't make phone calls. It's a no. Topic, Taoism. Teacher Lee Sang Boon. Let's learn about Wu Zing, commonly known as the Five Elements. People today think that the Five Elements are simple, that the whole thing is an easily understood concept, so the importance of the real meaning is lost in the modern day. The Five Elements... Shh. That's the janitor. Fuck, why I bought, why I fucking do that? Oh my god, please, sir. Please don't come in here, please, janitor. He goes inside rooms. I know, I gotta cut the fucking light. He's right next door. I gotta cut this fucking light. I need to cut this fucking light. Now I know why you don't turn on the lights. What have I done? Turned off the light himself. Wow, this game is sort of scary, dude. It's a little scary, this game. He's walking back around. I mean, I can't go this way. He left. He's gone to the other zone. Let's turn back on the lights, bro. Bro, lights are back on, baby. Party's back in session. Everyone, come on out. Party's back on. Let's party. It's party o'clock again. I'm checking these desks because one of them was openable. Now I got to check them all. Okay, these are all locked. I haven't found a single one that's unlocked. Ah. What the hell's going on with that? What is all this? Chief Director Ui Jungbyun. She looks serious. Changu Park. This one seems familiar. This one's got alive eyes. Undo Lee. His eyes are moving. Jae Eun Lee. His beard is very nice. Jong Saw Lee. I'm guessing these seem like the devs. Dev inserts, you know? Which is fine by me. Why am I hearing like sounds from over? Oh, no, 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 no. I hear you, you little fuck. I hear you, you little fuck. It's a note. The effects of caffeine. Caffeine works by stimulating the central nervous system, making the head clearer and keeping the body awake and overall more active. Coffee is the most well-known and readily available source of caffeine. It's very good at increasing physical and mental performance over a short period, but consuming more than 400 milligrams a day is j dangerous. Such an overdose can cause fatigue and nausea, hot vomiting, hyperactivity, and headaches. A cup of coffee usually contains 100 mg. I don't, yeah, you can't give me a look up. 
but excessive amounts can kill around five, 50 to 200 cups of coffee is sufficient to kill your average person. Shut up. Especially in a pregnant woman or babies is significantly lower. A coffee can be enjoyed as long as you do. The walkthroughs for this game are all scuffed. Can you blame them though? They're writing walkthroughs for a game no one's ever playing ever. You know how hard it was to get this game to work? Extremely. So I don't really blame them, to be honest. I was walking around to make the ghost despawn. All right, we're continuing down the hall. In the second, hang on. I'm trying to keep post, uh, keep like aligned with the, um, aligned with the walkthrough to some extent. I'm not really using it a ton, but I want to make sure I'm at the right point in it when I go somewhere. So if I get lost, I'm not going to like get confused. Oh, a bathroom. I need to save. Though I don't technically need to yet. Okay, that takes us up to the fourth floor. It'll be nice to have a bathroom accessible. Though. One of these bathrooms is going to have a monster in it. Don't want you guys to get spooked, but eventually it's happening. Hang on, I want to do the other bathroom first because I think that's the one that's going to have... Is that a coffee machine? No, it's a water machine in a sink basin. Oh my god. Uh, please! This is normal. There's no reason for him to come in here. There's no fucking reason for him to come in here. Get in a stall. I can I don't know what's in the stalls. Fuck off! Is he getting closer to me? <gasps> Come on, dude! You got a lot of floors to clean up, dude! It's okay, I, I can finish up this one for you, dude! It's fine! I've always respected you a lot. I'll be, I'll, I'll help you clean up the game. You... Get lost. <laughs> Just go away. I was afraid to turn around. I think he's going. No. No, 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 no. We're done for a minute. I gotta take a break. No, 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 no. Too much high concentrated weirdo shit going on, Chad. I can't, I can't do it all at once. I can't do it all at once. I need like a fucking... <laughs> I'm just... <laughs> I can't do it all at once. I'm running... I'm running out of... I'm running out of power. Why? Oh, why? I don't want to die, Chad! I haven't saved in a while! I don't want to die. If there's someone in there, make it... Can you give me one second over there? Please stop opening the doors. 
give me a minute. All of you can calm down for a fucking second, right? I'm going to throw up. Look up. I don't think I'm going to do that. This ghost is going to have to make me look up. I'm a dog now. All right. What are, what are you doing? You think it's fucking funny? Where are you at? I'm getting this my money now. They're happy. I took it. Why don't you just make it stop? There wasn't even a save point in here. I saw something. 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 I'm walking away. I, I saw something. I saw a demon. I saw a demon. I, I, El, Diab El Diablo. I saw El Diablo in there. I saw a ghost. I saw, I saw something. I saw it. You guys saw it too. You saw it right there. Was something that came out of the fucking stall. Like a little, like a little JPEG of a ghost. It could have been anything. Could have been made out of cardboard. I don't know. I saw it. I saw it. Did the game pause? The game pauses when you press pause. It's not, it doesn't, it's not a liar. See? It was there. It's coming out of the fucking stall. I saw it. That bathroom's not a bathroom. It's a demon hole. Can I get a clip? Someone get that for me? For once? Now? Maybe? Right now. Get me the clip. Please. Please. I don't need it. I don't, I, I, oh, God. Oh, God. Someone actually did post it. I can't show this on stream because it's actually incredibly awkward to do that with my setup. But I can see it in slow motion and tell you if I actually saw a ghost or not. Give me a second. <laughs> I did not. If I look at things, I did not. Or did I? Wait. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I actually saw a ghost. I think this is just my psychosis. You did. You're right. I'm not sure. Chat, it's like so dark on the screen. It's hard to tell. But I think I saw something. But it might just be psychosis. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I'm not going back in there. The ghost with the weirdo sounds is in there. I'm going to go this way. Door's fucking locked. Hang on. Walk through Chan. Am I doing it right? Walk through Chan. Computer room. Check. I did that. Go back to the hallway. Grab ramen on the top of a refrigerator. I didn't ever see a refrigerator. Did I see a refrigerator and just pass it? Did I pass a room back here? I skipped this room. Hang on. What's this? Medical room. Night watchman's room. I skipped this room, I think. Because it was broken. Yeah, I didn't go in here because it was, it was awful. Because it's broken. I'm going to seal myself in here. And turn on a... Turn on this thing and... Get some dang food from the janitor's office. Soybean milk. Is it... Does the fridge have an interior light? Nice. Newspaper on the ground. It's a note. Yongdu newsletter, newsletter, summer edition, the secret of the second floor's lost and found room. Our school has an excellent system for lost property. The policy is to keep lost items until the owner returns for it. With each item classified by date, it was discovered. Among these items are several expensive things, such as watches or jewelry. After a set time, owner lists items are given to anyone who wants them. The so-called secret of the lost, lost and found room is about the strange properties it has. Some say there is a bad omen in the room, which is somehow linked to forgotten items owned by dead students. Read this true account by a student. A Miss C found a cushion in the room that she thought looked beautiful. She desperately wanted it and hoped that the owner would not come back to retrieve it. When at last, when at last it was classified in the free section, she rushed, she rushed and took it. However, it disappeared from her house the next day. 
and returned to its place in the room. She took it back home, only for it to disappear again the next day. She went back to the lost and found room and found it in the same place. Several attempts later, Miss C gave up and simply left the cushion where it was. Another time, a former student returned to the school and was astonished when he found an old music, music box in the lost and found that had been there when he was a student at the school. It's logical to say that these items could be the possessions of dead students. Is it logical? However, there is one mystery that is yet to be investigated. There is always the same quantity of items in the lost and found. Be sure to read next week's newsletter. It's a lighter. Don't mind if I do. Activates with F, that's fucking good. So now... I mean, it's not great, but it's light. And light's pretty epic. You know what I mean? Chat. Here's the thing. The guide said... I, Because I was just making sure I was at the right part in the walkthrough. And it says run to the bed. And then run out. And I'm getting worried I made a big mistake. Picking up that lighter. Okay, well, we're going into the next room. Why did I skip these two rooms? Because I definitely skipped the next one as well. Always clear. Clear as it can be. I think the trick to the janitor is to close... Why did that scare me? It was just a shake. Is to close the doors as I get to them so that I'm not getting caught by the janitor for, like, rooms being fucked. Oh, come on. This is the room with the sword evil lady. Let's just take a look around quick. First aid kit. I'll take it. Anything else? No. The poltergeist could definitely do the... I saw her! See that? And the janitor's back. Why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> I don't understand what I did wrong to deserve it. <clears throat> this gives me time to read the walkthrough. I'm supposed to examine the jacket on the chair and it'll drop a key, which I probably would have missed if I didn't do this. Do you just open the fucking door? No. Stop this. Ghost Chan. Hang on. One more, one minute. The game is paused. She's making sounds, but it doesn't matter. Okay? It doesn't. She's not real right now. Get the key. Leave the room. Go to the far end double doors. It'll take you to the hall with washrooms and stairs. I would recommend saving here, but you'll have to use the save point on the second floor. A good way to avoid the janitor is by not avoiding him. Make him follow you to the top of the stairwell, and you notice that there is no guardrail at the bottom. He wants me to fucking bait the janitor away like a psychomaniac. This guy. And that's not happening in a million years. Let me just get the key. It's the PE teacher's coat, so the rumors are true. The nurse is in a relationship with the PE teacher. Something fell off. It's a key. Student department key. I gotta get out of here before Ghost Chan fucking kills me. It's time to go save. 25! 24! Hop! 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 Hike! <laughs> you cannot move to another area! <laughs> if I'm dead now because of this, I can't see where I am. I'm alive. Okay, turns out you can't go back to other areas. I will live. I will never die. I might die. 
Depends on how fucking good I am at cardio. If they said there's no guardrail up here, I'm gonna believe them. <laughs> they can't do this forever. I've got fucking, I've got young spry legs. This is what they were talking about. Maybe he'll never come up. You'll have to save on the second floor. Good way to avoid janitors by not avoiding them. Allow them to follow you up to the top of the stairwell. And you notice that there is no guardrail at the top. Get the janitor to follow you up as far as you possible can. Jump down and run away. Go back to the second floor washrooms area. But that didn't have a... I don't think I can travel back. And I took fall damage for that. Pass. Double pass on that floor. That one has a baby. So we're going to we're going to check this floor. One of these, these are all washroom accessible. One of them has to have a usable washroom notepad. Right? No, that's a healing kit. Turned off the lights for me. Well, then that means I'm not going in there, bitch. <laughs> Whoever did that, I'm not going in there now. You've lost me privileges. There's no save point here either. Okay, next floor. <laughs> All right, the next floor. Fucking ghost. Spirit soul, soul emblem. I want to save, but I want to wait till he's not at the fucking door camping me. He's not going to figure this one out. This is like foolproof. He's an AI from 2001. I don't buy it. I don't buy it. He's from 2001. When he leave, we're gonna save the game. Okay? Are those two separate people walking? He's below me, I think, is what's happening. I saw the dagger ghost. The one that stabs you. Save time. I wish this ghost wasn't here, but... You know, it's as good as we're gonna get it! <laughs> not looking up is pretty tolerable. I can handle that. That's not that bad. I'm gonna go with this first aid kit from this one. They can't scare me twice out of it, you know? Or whichever one was in this room. I don't know what was in this room again. I'm gonna check all these stalls, chat. Now that I've saved, I can be brave again. I won't lose as much progress. So let's check all these dang fucking stalls for those good pieces of gear that I like so much. And let's also close this door while we do it so the janitor doesn't get suspicious. Nothing. Literal stalling. I mean, I guess that's better than you just saying I'm stalling. Because I'm just actually stalling, looking for things in stalls, like money. Ghost Chan, you're like this least scary one. No, I've decided. You got me one time, it's the only time you'll ever get me. Okay, so I've got the key to the student department. I'm not sure exactly what that means. Notice the yellow seal lock on the double doors to the south. That's their next exit. You don't have the seal for this. It's the earth thing. Okay. Exit the double doors to the main hallway. Apparently this is the second floor. 
Oh, this is the second floor. Okay, I'm actually where I'm supposed to be. This is actually, I actually, I, I'm accidentally exactly where I'm supposed to be. I didn't even realize. Mmm, very good. I see another bucket in the middle of the hall. Don't mind if I do. Wait, I got everything else I needed on that floor, right? I think so. Hello? Hello, it's me! <laughs> I'm coming into the room! I'm excited to get adventuring! It's a note! It's for ghost stories! <laughs> That's always a good sign! The reverse ghost! The main building's chemistry room is, the f is famous for ghost sightings. On rainy days, people go to visit the third and fourth floors of the main building's second area because of the incident that happened in the chemistry room long ago. During a science lesson, the room suddenly shook, and the apparatus with acidic and toxic fumes cracked. Misuk was looking down at the apparatus at the time, and it shot all over her, all over her, severely burning half of her face. She was rushed to the medical room, but they couldn't help the damage. Misuk was very was a very self-conscious girl, so it also affected her mentally. From then on, Misuk's life was isolated from outside. She went through a phase of depression. One night, she was so intensely upset that she climbed onto the roof of her parents' house while they were out and jumped onto the concrete path below. It was never certain whether she wanted to fall directly onto her head or not. People still see Misuk around the chemistry room of the second area of the main building with her back to everyone. She hides her face so no one can see it. They say that if someone does see her face, they will almost certainly die. Mmm, yes. <laughs> I certainly know what I will not be doing then. That's very good advice. And where would that chemistry room be now? Council's office A. I haven't found a map. Do I have a map? I do have a map. Teacher's affairs, student affairs room is there. I can open that now. Okay. So we can open that door. Chemistry room isn't on the- DON'T LOOK UP! Chat, with the monster, you can hear when the monster's there, but I'm not gonna look up anyways, because why would I ever want to see the ceiling? You know what I mean? That's- that's sort of the point there. Why would I ever want to see the ceiling? Why would I bother? I'm in. Two, eight... I DON'T HAVE TIME FOR THIS CUTSCENE! It comes. Mm -hmm. I, it was 28 and then an up arrow and then a one. So I don't know if that was 28 for one or what. I think I actually am pretty sneaky while I'm crouching. I think I can do some crouch exploration without him getting mad at me genuinely I think I'm okay to do that no I'm not what am I doing I'm a psycho why am I being why am I being a maniac get back behind this desk just get lost man just go home what the fuck was that? Man, it's dark in here. Guys, imagine playing on the difficulty where I can instantly die and it's even darker. Real difficulty. Didn't even end up closing this door. What did I just see? I saw something. In the light of the window. And it wasn't a person. It wasn't... What I usually see, I swear to God, I saw something. But I can't fucking see anything because it's janitor and, like, loiters! He's loitering. He never leaves. Ghost Chan. If 
Fuck off! He's so slow and old! Oh, he's stuck on a door. Oh. He'll get there. That's why he's been here for so long. He doesn't know how to do it. So fucking old. You really know he's not looking my direction. <laughs> you know what that means, chat? I almost knocked this over. I bet he'd look over here and get so fucking mad. You know what that means, chat? I got a lot of time to explore this hallway without him getting involved. Because he can't do anything. He's an idiot and he's stuck on a fucking door over there. It's locked. Okay, what room is this? School affairs room. Don't believe I have the key for that. It's just still over there. Box room. Wait, what room is this? What is this? What am I hearing? Lost? Oh no, it's the property room. It's where all the lost items go. We read about this. It's a clay doll in a box. And a diary. The clay doll's looking at me like he's gonna kill me. That is cursed. Janitor check. He's gonna be there all day. That works out for me, dude. That works out for me, dude. Okay. Pass one door, blah 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 You'll have to go in, blah blah blah, go into a room. First door on the inside, you'll see a very brief cutscene pointing your attention to the chalkboard. I wasn't able to do that because that guy was there. I'll go back for that. Okay. Uh pass code for the locked door on the ground floor, but thankfully we don't need to work it out. It's the same every time. Awesome! Okay, so that key that password is for the principal's office. Right. On the wall. Okay, so that's good. We can do that in a minute. Now, the real question is, do I want to pick up these fucking cursed items? My tech deck might be underneath them. A diary. 14th of February, Valentine's Day. I gave him some chocolate. He said he doesn't like it, but he ate it anyway and seemed happier. It's only been about three months, but I feel like we've known each other for a long time. I hope this relationship will last. Even when he says he loves me, I still worry. He only loves me, right? 20th of February, I caught a cold. I called him up. He shouted across the phone. It surprised me how happy he was to hear me. He's not usually a very emotional person. It was a little awkward because he was so cute like that, but I still wondered what he was talking about when he said, Why are you crying? I wasn't crying at all. 26th of February, I gained some weight. Recently, I gained some weight. He called me a fatty, but it's okay. He's just not very good at expressing his true feelings. I called him an idiot and he apologized, but we still love each other, really. 5th of March. Everyone seems very happy today. I didn't leave home during our week off. A new term started and I haven't seen him since. I know he's busy, but I miss him. I've been thinking deeply about everything recently. Everyone else seems to be happy but me. 14th of March, White Day. <laughs> That's this day, technically. My classmates were talking with... Kum Jin all day because she was left candy on her desk overnight. Damn bitch. She's such a snob. I was furious. I just wanted to die. 20th of March. Spring hasn't come yet. I caught a cold again today. I'm now a senior at high school and he still hasn't returned yet. But I talked to him over the phone today. He said, we're still students, so we need to focus on our work more than us for the moment, which was strange of him. I suddenly felt suspicious. Sometimes I feel he isn't coming back, but that's ridiculous. He's coming back. 25th of March, our anniversary. Today is our anniversary, but we didn't even talk. Apparently, he's still busy, but I desperately need, to he need his voice and smile. It's so painful knowing he isn't here. I can't control it. I feel like I just want to die over and over. 4th of April, pregnancy test. I'm worried about my test, about my results. And what he's going to think if I am having a baby. When should I tell him? Maybe he won't care. But if it's too much for him to take. 8th of April. He's so cold. If I don't kill my baby, then he will leave me. I'm so afraid. I just want this to end. 
I decided I'll give birth to my baby. Even at the risk of my own life, as I write this, my art textbook next to me is open on a page with the clay model of a mother and her child holding hands. I see. <laughs> Fuck you! Hey, asshole! Where'd you go? Let's tango! I put out my fucking guns! I'm about to- I'm about to, I, I, I'm like- I, I look like fucking Popeye! Come on! Come on out then! You don't fucking take a swing at me, I'll take you down! Look up. Didn't even need to look up. She was just there. Oh my god. Chat. The janitor found a way around the door. That's not good, class. That's not good at all. What happened? What happened? Oh, this is a sign. I should probably just leave that going. Now then. And he's coming back. <laughs> Just let me look in the room, Janitor Chan! The door, this door's always open. He's coming. He's coming. I don't know what to deal with those lights, cause his. <gasps> oh my god! He's after me! He's after me right now! He's on me! <laughs> he came in the room. actually found me. I mean, he's following me, but I don't think he knows I'm here. Let's see if he can hang handle the, the rodeo. I want to get that note. I already saw the rest of it. I gotta get back to the first floor hallway. I know what I have to do. I gotta get to the principal's office. But this fucking janitor. This fucking guy is everywhere. I guess I can come back for that note later. The janitor's being a real fucking tool right now, you know what I'm saying? He's slow, but if he hits me, you guys saw he took me down to fatal in like five seconds. He could easily fucking kill me if he caught me in a corner. He's stuck on the door again, that stupid fuck. Alright, this is my chance to get downstairs then. Easy. It's as simple as that, Chad. It's as simple as that. Let's get to the principal's office and plug in these numbers. I vaguely rem No. That's impossible. That's impossible. He didn't free himself already. That's impossible. I don't believe it. Oh, you fucking asshole. This guy is like omnipresent, dude. He can see the fucking future. He's like smelling me. Don't come in. I'm gonna have to do that like classic thing where I stand on the opposite side of the fucking table from him. Okay, man. Omnipresent means all present. Omniscient means all knowing. I think you're trying. I I know what you're trying to do here by trying to correct that, but I said omnipresent because he's all present. He's been here every time I do something. 
So I don't think you understand what I was saying. You know? <laughs> I know you're bidding, but you're doing a bit, but like... <laughs> I said omnipresent because that's what I meant. If he was omniscient, he would follow me up the fucking stairs and actually get me. But well, he doesn't. Because he sucks. It's 2841. Let me plug it in. Two. Eight. Four. One. I'm in. Colonel, I've made it into the principal's office. Let's get to the bottom. This is a really nice office. Too bad these are the worst tables ever and the worst chair ever, and no one is going to be comfortable sitting in this place. There's no space for your legs. This is awful. This is fucking heinous. It hurts to look at. We have here a note. The main water pipe has been cut off in the main building, but for some reason... The water still works in the main building science room on the third floor. We haven't found the cause for this yet, but we will look into it. The major works on the main building's water pipes will, be, be, will begin as of next week. I see. Okay. It's a note. Han Yan Yong, uh, 23rd of September, birthday. Female, grade 3, class 11. Na Yong has had good grades in grade 1 and 2, but she left school in her third. She had no school or family problems at the time, so the reason for this was never found. She was later found hung by a red rope at school, but it is not clear whether this was a suicide or homicide. Suicide was written on her death certificate with no underlying causes. Did the light turn off? Or is the light on? It's just this terrible, the lighting in here. It's a coin. Another 500 yen coin for me. And another note. Kim Ji Won. Ji Won was killed in school premises with, in the year 2000 with no one attending her funeral. It is unclear whether this was a suicide or homicide, but evidence pointed towards a suicide. Toward the end of her life, she was unsocial with the other staff members. She was a teacher. Deliberately avoiding contact with other people, it was sad that she was in the middle of developing a theory which explained the school's frequent deaths and hauntings. Whether or not this led to her symptoms of paranoia is also unclear. The combination lock in the music room makes use of her own song's chord progression, which can be accessed through the music room's telephone. Hell? It's a videotape. The label's been ripped off. What the hell is all this? He's been watching us. That's the hallway. That's that fucking hallway I was just in. What's this one? It's a janitor. That old bag. Look at how bald he is. I fucking hate him. What's he... How's he doing? He's climbing up on a stool and putting a key on the top of the bookshelf in the computer room. What's happening in this one? This is the chemistry room. Isn't there a ghost that lives in this one? Yeah, I want, D I want DC on this one. I want to be in this one. And I, I didn't want to watch it again. There's a ghost in this one. I don't want to see the ghost. Right, get me out of here! Get me the fuck out of here! Please. Get me out! Get me out! Get me out! I don't want to be in it! Thank you. What's this one? Sinks. Sinks are pretty epic. Try this. Horror game's fucking awesome. This is like actually one of my favorite horror games I've played in a long time. Like, genuinely. This game's awesome. So far. All right. I'll be able to see him. Activate camera. He, he doesn't know. Um, look at his dis. Look at his wa. Oh my god, he does not know. 
Hi. No! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Don't go in the, do not pay attention, do not pay no attention to the man inside of the principal's office. There's no one in here. Don't come in. Just do not, we are full. We're full! You can't fit in! Did he leave? He's fucking leaving. No, he's coming back. Yeah, I need to wait for him to turn around before I can do my thing. You know what I mean? Oh, good. I need to cut this light. <gasps> you can't legally come in here! <laughs> Bye. Get fucking bamboozled by the best. Unfair! At least the stairwell bit works well. You get stuck on that door every time. Chase me. I need, I need to ditch him up here. I'm gonna actually try to do it. He's so dumb, though. He's not... <laughs> He's so fucking dumb most of the time, though. He's like, actually, like, sometimes just doesn't even follow me up. It's only fast when he wants to, and it keeps freaking me out. Hey, I'm right here. Chase me. Fucking, he's so slow, but then he's fast at the same time. He's very quick on his feet, but only occasionally. Ah. See you later. <laughs> get fucking, get clowned on. Wait, what do I do now? Hang on. Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. I gotta get to the computer room. It's the bottom floor. We walk now. Close this for added safety. I really close this so I'll hear him open. And now, we're going to the computer room. Right? No, this is school affairs. No, this is a computer. I gotta get that thing from the top of the bookshelf. Now. I gotta read this note, but I'll do that later probably because he's probably coming back. Announcement, the principal does not like people intruding in his office when he's not there. So the password to the lock has been changed. Oh, I already got that. Wow, epic. It's Knife Ghost. I'm not fucking surprised they'd come back. It's a key. Hey, don't look to your right right now. My right. There's a ghost. <laughs> Uh, wait, what was it? Um, uh, uh, I'm looking at the chat. I was just curious if it would say anything. Turns out both options are bad here, and a ghost is about to kill us both. So, um, no, not yet. Do you fucking hear that? Hey, do you fucking hear that? Do you fucking hear that? Uh, how are you so calm right now? We're about to die. Do you fucking hear that? Mm. Don't go. Please don't go. Okay. Why is everything so low res? asks a chat member. Hi. Games were made before the year 2020. And sometimes you play a game that was made 20 years ago and is still better than most of the horror games that have been made in the last 20 years. Which at this point, chat, the more I play of this, the more pathetic a lot of horror games are looking now to me. Actually, so what, wait, what kind of key was it? I'm following you. I'm going with you. You ain't leaving my fucking sight. We're going together. I'm going with you. I'm staying with my friend. But the janitor, she's slower. This girl's slower than me. 100%. She'll die first, which is fine. Uh... What just happened? 
Can that knife ghost leave? 저기 저기 되네. 가끔 여자애 하나가 쪼그려 앉아 있대. 귀신인지 모르고 그냥 비켜 지나가면 발목을 확 잡는데. There's a ghost on the stairs now, huh? Do you believe it? I I don't fucking know, I guess. I mean, I believe in the ghost. There's one trying to kill us right now. Why are you leaving? I need to eat soy milk to survive. To eat soy to survive. Where are we going? I'm coming with you. Oh, no, not you two. Not you two. Not you two. You're all jammed up on the door. Not you two. Don't do this. You gotta not. I freed you. Go on now. There you go. Hey. Are we going still? What's up? Where are we fucking go Where is she fucking taking me? Can this ghost fuck off? Can this ghost get the fuck out of here? Well, I guess I'll go without you. Bye. Oh, okay. It was a cutscene. Are you hearing that too? Knife ghost is pissing me off. The music teacher, she died. Remember? You remember the music teacher. That's it! Where are you? Where are you? Just come down, get me! Get me, pussy! We're come down! Come down and fight me! I will fight you! Let's just go! She's actually scared of me. She's actually like camping. She's scared of me. She knows if she comes down to fight me, she's gonna lose. Teacher's lounge key. Well, come on in. Whoa! It's other girl with the glasses. Do you also hear the sound of a ghost with a knife? Eyeball. Eyeball. Eyes. High resolution eyes. The new building? Do you know the story about the music teacher? I read about it. Okay, or no way. <laughs> okay. Then come to the new building as soon as possible. Okay. I'd love to do that. Where come out? Come out and fight me, coward! I will kill you, I will fucking kill you! I'm gonna run. Try to lose it. Lost him. That easy. Ah, that's nice. 
I gotta go back there, though, which means that ghost is camping. I'm not gonna save yet, chat, because I need those save things for, like, actual fucking... Th like, I gotta... S I only have four save tokens right now. That's not as many as you'd think. It doesn't feel like a lot to me. I'm not gonna save for nothing just because the ghost is there. And now they're gone, so it's fine. Okay. So, let's take a look around. Got an idea of what we gotta do. Remote control. It's a remote control for a Nori CD player. Nori cassette player right here. If I recall, the CD player is hidden in the music room. <laughs> I let her kill me because I'd rather her fuck off. I actually, I, I saw her spawn right in front of me. I allowed it to happen because I prefer that over listening to that for another fucking second. Treasure hunting. Some of the students have become part of a strange treasure hunt around the school. This would have been, this wouldn't have been an issue if it weren't for the fact that the supposed treasure uh, is not any old coin or locket. It's the personal CD that was used, that used to belong to Mrs. Kim, the music teacher who killed herself a while ago. Students say that there was a CD that Mrs. Kim made before she died. They say it is not just any CD, but it is sort of like Mrs. Kim's will. Because of its mysterious, almost mythical existence, the old CD is becoming more and more valuable to its hunters. Some students have been betting on it in huge amounts, too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I see, I see. Money! I have a lot of money. I need to start spending it on, I think, soda. I think you buy soda with money in this game. Like, that's the whole point of it. Should probably start investing in the soda market. Uh-huh. Oh, there's a light. Okay, cool. I thought I was going to get killed. A game package? Astonish a story repackage. Collect all 10 of these game packages hidden around the school for a super secret ice cream surprise. I love it. Oh, no. There's no way the janitor comes all the way into here. This is like hyper private. It's a key. Science room key. Oh no. Chad, I know the science room. What's this here? A note. Handling junk in the music rooms. The music player in the music the music player in the music equipment room sometimes turns on disrupting lessons. No one wants to go in there because of the rumor that it's being controlled by a ghost, specifically the ghost of Kim Ji Won. The music teacher who died a while ago. It's probably just faulty. Anyway, the music player will be given to Kim Ji Won's family when they can be found. There's nothing really else we can do with it until then. He's coming. This is actually the safest place to be. Because if he comes after me right now, I can run around the chairs. So I'm just going to wait here for him. If he's going to come. All right, light switch. Uh, get the remote control. It's been a pleasure, fuck all it really is. Are oh, you too slow to catch me? You too slow and old, old man. You too old to catch me. You always will be. You weren't getting any younger, and I'm only getting more spry. See ya. Bye bye. Too powerful. I'm gonna wait at the top and figure out where I need to go next because I'm following this walkthrough like a, like a gospel at this point. Like for real, I just am. Sorry, chat. I am. I don't want to get that that part with the tree fucked me up. And now I'm like I'm basically sort of giving you guys a somewhat streamlined experience because otherwise we are accursed forever. Uh, I so I got the remote control. Okay. Look around the desks. A few coins. One save marker. Open the single door. Correct. Get a key. Uh. Take the key, look behind the blue trash bin, got it. Then take a right and walk to the end, you'll see an apparition. You'll be next to the far room. There's a storeroom. Enter it and open the box. It contains a statue and a book. I already got those. So we're ready to go to the third floor, main hallway. All right, we're going to the science lab. We already got the stuff from the uh, storeroom. So we're going to the third floor. I mean, like, I wouldn't be using a walkthrough if I was, like, not streaming, but, like, on stream, I think we can all agree it's not very fun when I lose all hope in myself being able to beat a level. And I just get really fucking sad and confused. I don't think that's very fun to watch. 
And it's kind of fun. Well, you're kind of a, a psycho. You know? It's locked. Chat, it is time to save now. I will say that. I believe it's time to save. But I don't remember which one of these rooms has a save token. Oh, this has first aid. Oh, yeah, this is the cursed room that turns off the lights when I walk in. The janitor's on the other side of that fucking door doing his clown moves again. You can hear him. He's spooking. I want to save. I think it's on the second floor, but I also think there's a janitor on the second floor who's going to be doing his crazy thing, you know? Ha! Peripheral fucking... His FOV must be like five! Oh, he's turning back around again. Old eyes, man! He's got old eyes. Old eyes. Is he coming up? He's going down. Old eyes. He's got bad eyes. You can only see 1440p eyes. He's got stupid eye. This gives me time to save. I know creaking floorboards alert him. I'm guessing this game's sound effects work a lot like Thief. And good news is, chat, I think we can all agree I'm pretty good at Thief. So, um, I can, I can definitely do sneaking right. I'm pretty good at sneaking. Pretty good at sneak. Debatable. <laughs> Tell that to the guy who beat, who did fucking death's cold embrace campaign so good the fucking literal maker of the map commented in my video and said damn that was some good stuff thanks for playing my map that's right chat that's how that's how good i am wait i'm on the right floor what am i doing hello which one of these is science room? Science room? Chat member, we're looking for the science lab. Which... Which floor am I on? Am I on the wrong floor? Am I supposed to be on third floor? Not second. I'm an idiot. Science is on the third floor. We want to go to the third floor where a ghost is going to try to kill us, I believe. Because we've, we're have we overdue for a ghost to get us in the game, you know what I mean? Been a lot of janitors and stuff. Hello? Oh, yeah, this is baby floor. Hello? This sounds like a dentist office. With, like, the suction thing? <laughs> we want this one. It's unlocked. Hey, it's me! I'm here for my tech deck! What's poppin', gamers? Got a note here. The diet of death. Young Mi's personal personality and shape had always been influenced by expectations of others. She'd always be heard saying she was in the middle of a diet despite the fact that nobody ever saw her as obese or even overweight. It wasn't long before she began to doubt every compliment that other people gave her and treated them as though they were being cruel and sarcastic. Getting desperate, she began to drastically change her image on a regular basis, even if it made her look worse. Young Mi later showed symptoms of cetophobia and was put in a mental hospital. It didn't help, and she kept refusing to eat until she finally died from starvation. Since Young Mi's death, school life has carried on as if nothing ever happened. That's uh, awesome. That's really cool, school. Is this sink making noise? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> that is a grody water. <laughs> Something's wrong with us. 
What was that? Water raw? <laughs> Heavy water. Extra thick water. Nothing. Well, looks like we're moving on. He's gonna come in here and fucking kill me, dude. I think he just cut out the middleman and literally came into the room I don't know the layout of to get me. Don't do it to me, please. Stop moving. He's gonna see me. Anyways, chat, my best bet is to fucking totally bamboozle him. <laughs> see? <laughs> you think I wanna hide? Nothing ever works out when you hide. Best bet's running every single time against this fucking guy. I'm much more powerful when I sprint by him like a maniac. Check it, check it. All right? Idiot. Idiot loser. Never had a chance. Because he's old. <laughs> Never stood a fucking chance against me. Old lit. Chat, old lit. <laughs> yeah, follow me the rest of the way up. I want you out of my fucking hair for a while, old man. For a fucking while. It's a worthy loss. Taking that hit there. And wait, he's already got me again. <laughs> he is a fucking, he's really after me today. <laughs> close the door behind me, or a ghost fucking close the door behind me. I can close every door in the building, why don't you? <laughs> Is he actually done this time? I gotta buy soy milk. <laughs> oh my god. He's really on me this time. I've never struggled this much to ditch him before. <laughs> What's his fucking deal? He's still on me. No, he isn't. Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Yes, he is. Oh my god! Is he, like, locked on to me? The light isn't the problem, chat. Like, I, I was in the corner. Wait right there. No, dude! He's no- Not fucking now, Piano Chen! Get the fuck out of my way, asshole! Okay, he's killing me. Okay, he's killing me. I'm stuck on him. I'm stuck on him. Oh my god. I cannot fucking believe I can't lose this guy. I can't believe it. Use it. We're gonna have to- We're gonna have to do- one of my super bamboozle plays. And now Knife Ghost is here. He may actually not follow me up this time. He might actually not have seen me that time. No, he knows I'm here. I just don't know why I can't lose him this time. He knows I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> and now he's coming up again. Oh my god, I take fall damage every time. I'm gonna try to- I'm gonna add as much distance as possible vertically. To like, guarantee that he can't be still- he's still- he's going to like get stuck like a thousand times doing this.
Like, I'm adding so much distance this time that he should just instantly lose track of me. This time, there should be so much distance from us, he should just immediately give it up. And then we can deal with Piano Chan. I believe this has worked. I believe he has officially lost aggro on me. Which means now I just have to get back to the third floor and hopefully he's not camping it. But this asshole hears me every single time I touch a door. So I'm not sure how the fuck this is gonna play out. The thing that spooks me is that like, the more of this I do, the more difficult it's gonna be to remember what I didn't do. He is just relentless. His hearing aid is in red right notch yet. I'm trying to see if he goes through this floor. There's nothing I've done to get his attention. He's on wood. Be the only chance I have. This might be my chance. Okay, he's probably watching the stream. I'm almost positive of it, but it's almost impossible to tell what floor of the like the ladder, the stairs I'm on. I can't believe I fucked that up 18 times before I actually figured out these were stairs I'm on, and not like a ladder or an elevator or escalators. I'm on stairs. We've lost him. We're gonna take it so fucking slow. This is the correct floor. Is that Knife Ghost? I'm speeding up a little bit. We'll be here all day otherwise. And there's an earthquake. Piano Chan, we're here, I'm here. Pause the game. Okay. Music room. Turn on the light, examine the piano, examine the small stool to the left of the piano for two notes. Another puzzle, very good. One of which you can take. Look in the corner to find the piano. Behind the piano, there's a telephone on the wall. Use the top right button to activate the speaker phone. Now try dialing 2222, then 3698. Awesome, this one actually has a set solution. That's lovely. Thank you. I'm not turning on the lights. It's a piano, it's playing by itself. Oh. Just yesterday at 9, I'll read this later. Like, I actually don't believe I have time. It's a note. Mary had a little lamb. Ring, ring, please go away. School bell. What was that last one? Teletubbies. You see, some of the numbers on the telephone are connected to notes on a piano. I'm guessing I'm replicating the exact notes that the piano is playing on the phone. So, first of all, telephone, speakerphone. This isn't activating. I might need the lights on. My character might not be wanting to press it unless I have the lights on. Mm. 
No. Is it because of the lighter? I don't have to like turn on something else. I don't wanna be I don't wanna be here with the lights on for too long. Cause I'll get fucking in trouble. Top right button. Ah. Okay. Game told me to do this first. I don't know why. Okay. Three, six, nine, eight is the combination. Three, six, nine, eight. It lied. Okay, I just I just had to reset it. Hello. Why? Don't you fucking hang up on me? Oh my god. This is not a very good hiding spot. Look in the corner behind the piano, there's a telephone on the wall. Top right button to activate the speakerphone. Now try dialing 2222, then dial 3698. That's what it says. Oh my god, everything, everything is happening. Everything is happening, it is relentless. Fucking keeps turning on that, te that telephone. You can't get me. I am the piano now. Oh, really? Really? I've got him stuck on the piano. No, I don't. Oh my god, here we fucking go again, chat. Here we fucking go again, chat. Another rodeo with the fucking janitor. Did you find your tech deck yet? No, I have I have not found my tech deck yet. We may never find my tech deck. I'm blacking out. I don't know what's wrong with me. I think my I think I'm getting I think I'm overexerting myself. I'd like to see him find me in this one. This is a good hiding. This is actually like a really good fucking hiding spot. Everything's happening. I'm dying. The baby. Big baby. Is there a baby actually here? Is there a baby in the room with me right now? This is actually like a this is a premium spot. Yep. Get lost. That's right, asshole. This is actually freaky. I am concerned. Okay, hang on. Since we got some time. <laughs> examine the piano, examine the small stool for two notes. He is returning. Son of a bitch. The janitor might be a little bit rel too relentless for normal. This feels like hard. It feels like I'm on hard. He's on me like 100% of the time. Use the top right button to activate speakerphone. Now try dialing two. I guess we got time to read some notes while I'm here. I'm gonna post this because there might be... Okay. He's not coming back, is he? You see, some of the numbers on the telephone are connected to notes on the piano. You can press a key and the note will play. Please, please go away. 
Please go away. I feel like that's the one we're trying to play. I don't know. He came in the room, didn't he? No, he didn't. It's like next door. Hmm. What about this newspaper scrap? I had a scrap that just said zero. Remember? Remember? Remember that? You remember. I know you remember. You remember. You remember zero. It said zero. It just said zero. It just like popped up on the screen and said that. Well, I'm gonna need to test it, but that guy fucking hears everything you do. I don't have that much time. He's gonna hear me even open this door. Well, that's the problem, is that like, I cannot do this very easily because he hears everything I do. I'm gonna leave stuff exactly the way he's leaving it. And maybe that'll help me. Imagine if he was on a time limit. Yeah, that's like the fucking issue right now. I'm actually gonna save again on a separate slot. I feel like I have to. Because I don't really want to do the whole science part again. Because this is feeling like a lot of work to get this fucking phone to work. Wouldn't mind just getting a save in. You know what I mean? <laughs> Wouldn't mind just having a save at this point. I've lost, I would lose a lot of progress if you killed me. Awesome game though, don't get me wrong. These puzzles are fine. It's a really good game. If you can get it working. It's above me on the floor I need to go to. Son of a bitch. I need him out of this floor. He might fall. He's like actually camping. He's camping the room I need to go to. He's just camping. Bait him? I mean, it's not like I have jerky from Silent Hill to drop on the ground to bait the guy. I would love to. Sometimes I think he despawns, because that sounded like he just despawned. Or he went up to the next floor above us, above this one. Nope, he actually just saw me, because he's got super eyes. He's got very, very powerful eyes. He couldn't be able to know that I went downstairs and not upstairs. He knows. Oh my god. Fucking Jesus Christ, how do I get anything done in this game? He's like actually camping like the one place I need to go. He's camping me. Can you not kill him? He's an old man. Chat, that's, a, that's illegal and I'm not a criminal. Come on. Is there another stair? No, or I'd be taking it. He, if he comes into the stairwell, I'm dead. Well, I'm not dead, but I'll have to do an evasion tactic. He might be going down the hallway. He is. Now's my chance. Now's my chance while he's distracted. Looking at the chart, was on the second page of the telephone note. Compare it to the melody that piano plays. I get 3291. Well, how would... I mean, I guess I believe you, but I'm not sure how you'd be able to do it without hearing the piano right now. Unless, I guess you went back into the VOD to check. Maybe you did. By the way, I'm not going to turn on the light this time. That might help me not get caught as quick on the piano. Let's just take it slow and easy. Be careful. He's gonna hear this. This is the wrong room. Well, now he definitely heard it. 
Wait, is this even the right floor? It is. I'm not hearing piano chant. I don't want to actually call is the thing. I want to test what the tones were, game. That's all. Oh my God, it's going to make me do this every time. It definitely starts with a three. No. Oh, it's one. Wow, that doesn't sound anything like it. How the fuck am I supposed to actually get tones out of this thing? None of these sound anything close to the actual fucking tones. Try 7320 for an Easter egg? 3291, I'm gonna try that. Oh my god. Hang on, I gotta reset it. That sounds close-ish. Please? God? In heaven? God in heaven? 8196. Okay. 8196 now. I'll take it. 8196. Hello? 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 Answer the fucking phone, ghost. What? No! Oh my god. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh good, everyone is here. I know I'm not supposed to be moving, but I need to get away from the doors or he's just gonna see me when he opens them. Chat, that combination is to open another thing. That's actually part of the game. But... No, 8196 is what it's supposed to be. But it's to unlock another door somewhere else, apparently. Ghost Chan, please fucking go away. Please, God. Ghost Chan, you gotta have something better to do. Go to hell, Ghost Chan. How about that? It's a number lock. Wait, what did she say the number was changed to? Eight, it's just 8196 still. Eight. One. Nine. Six. It's unlocked. We're in. Fuck the piano thing, dude. I'm in. Chat, we're in. Can't fucking see, but we're in. I'm in. Colonel, I've made it into another room of the school. I'm in. It's a coin, I got it. Is that all that's in here? I see, oh, ba, ba, ba. It's a CD, it's too high to reach. What? It wants me to get the fucking stool from the science room, huh? Ghost Chant, can you just fucking go away? No one likes you. I'm done with her. She was scary first time, second time was sort of silly. Now it's like 
desperate and pathetic, you know? Do I actually have to get the thing from the fucking... Surely I don't have to bring that thing all the way up here. There's gotta be another stool in, like, this room or something that I can use to climb up. That's me. I just missed it. Can't carry that one. I don't think I can carry the piano stool. Nope. Ghost Chan. Honestly, this is pathetic. Oh, the remote? You think I use a remote to get that down? Like I blast the fucking stereo? Hang on. Yup. <laughs> I just consulted my book. My guide. My Sherpa. My game Sherpa. It says yes. It's a CD. We got it. Hello? Stop right there. One moment. One moment, sir. Give me one moment. Pull it with the mouse to show the front side. It has a key stuck to it. I'm sorry, what? Are you fucking saying they hid a key on an item? One moment, chat. Let me see about that. <gasps> uh, an unbeatable video game made by demons from hell. Oh my God. <laughs> what? Oh no, you fucking didn't lady. <laughs> How do you beat this game? Without, like, a guide! I see the key. How do I get it off? Use the key, use the CD with the key visible to remove the key. Truly, this is... This is a, this is the reason I now I'm, now I'm starting to see why these devs got fucking shut down the second after this game came out. <laughs> Cause while it was one of the best horror games anyone had ever played, did no one. <laughs> he there's no way he knows I'm in here. The light turned off automatically. Ghost Chan got me. Ghost Chan got me. Okay, chat? He's not hearing my fucking mic, is he? Because I swear to God he's making that sound whenever I talk. We're supposed to be going to the fourth floor after this, chat. And the name of the fucking floor is called Baby Steps. Which makes me think that that baby is going to be a fucking thing now. But first, I got to wait for Janitor to fuck off. This game shouldn't be able to hear my voice because my mic isn't connected to this computer. This computer doesn't have a microphone, the one I'm playing on. I'm gonna have to hook it in. Which I can. I have an option to do that now. I have a second cord that I can hook in for in-game VoIP, but I'm not using it. The five mic. Oh my god. Is he fucking done? Ghost Chan's about to get a slap. I'm un I cannot believe they keep fucking camping me. Alright. Let's get out of here. He's still here. He actually heard me open this door and he's coming back. It might be more convenient if he just gets me at this point so I can run by him. It is. Come on, let's fucking tango. Hey. Yeah, you know me. I'm one of the greatest. <laughs> I need to save once I get out of this place, too. 
Let's go bottom floor. The bottom floor doctor's office was where I lost him last time and it was fucking perfect. Like, incredible gameplay move. I know the door's open, but he's too stupid to check this corner and he did it last time and he fucked up last time too. If he's even still on me. I'm gonna miss it when the janitor is killed by a ghost and replaced by a actually scary being that scares the fuck out of me. He might not have me coming down. But might be worse for me. Wait. Weren't there some girls you were going to meet up with? Yeah. They are making me do all the work. I'm trying to get us out of this fucking shithole all by myself. They're laughing it up right now. They're having the time of their fucking lives. I'm trying to tell where the janitor is right now. I gotta save. Loudest fuck every time. I gotta get to floor three. You might see me doing this, but I have to take that fucking chance. Oh my god, come on, man! Fuck off! I this janitor's starting to really annoy me because <laughs> he just goes so fucking slow. He's so slow, it's like boring. Just fucking come up here. Get me. Come on. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the right floor. I need to save. Even if he's after me, I need to save. So, hopefully he won't come in here to get me while I'm doing this, because I need to save. Now we will bide our time. See, what's annoying is that he's just, an, he's not even scary now. He's just actually in the way of me progressing the story. He's like padding the game look. And like, yes, there are technically things I can do. I could just run by him every time, do what I need to do following a walkthrough, but then I'll miss stuff. But it seems like when you save, it might reset his aggro. I'm not sure. He doesn't seem to be here. Either way, I need to get up two floors. I need to go up to floor four. Never mind. Here he comes. He'll never check the stalls. He ain't smart enough to come into this stall. Promise there's no, you know what this game needed? A means to distract him. Like an actual way to distract him. Because there's no way for me to tell him to fuck off. There's nothing I can do to get him off of me. You know? So like, yeah, he's here. But I can't make him leave. There's nothing I can do to bait him to a floor so I can explore another at my, at my own, you know, leisure. I want to get to floor four and find out what's going on with the baby. But like, my guy's so fucking loud, I can't sneak. I think the guy's taking the stairs right now. He's gone, but he's gonna hear me do this because he always does. So I'm not really sure. Man, I almost wish he was just down the hall. Okay, so if he went down, we have a minute. If he went up, we're gonna be dealing with him still. We'll have to see. We gotta get to floor four. 
And hopefully at that point, we'll have like a fucking minute to ourselves. Who am I kidding though? Ghost Chan's gonna be there every step of the way. She's gonna be hanging out with me the whole fucking time. She can't help herself. Okay. This should be floor four. Because the next floor is the roof. Here we go. We've never been on this floor. We've, we've acknowledged this floor, but we don't really do anything on this floor. Hot coffee. All right. I should really be sneaking the whole way. Well, chat, new hallway, new me. It's good. I'm gonna have the lights off because or else the janitor will see me. But that's good. That's really good in the corner. That was good. I like that. Our coin. Like coin. I really like coin. I like having money. Everyone likes money. Save marker. I love it. I love it. Love seeing it. And a horrible mannequin of the human body screaming because they wanted to make this really feel like art. So they really made it look like he was screaming because most of his skin was ripped off on one side of him. Which is good. That's good. That's good. The science room. This is where all the chemicals hang out. The game says take a look around in here, but there's nothing to do in here. Hang on. Whoa, 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 Go through the double doors. Uh, go to the next double doors and lock them with the key that was stuck on the CD. You'll be in another science classroom. Open the single door on the other side of this room. The janitor shouldn't be a problem now. Yo! Good. I hope he dies. I hope he fucking trips and eats shit. And when he cries for help, I will laugh. Double doors. This one? No, no, this is the mannequin room. So we're going into this room. This double door is locked. And now it's unlocked. Come on, chat. I've got a horrible feeling about this one. This might be the worst one we've ever been in. I have a note. Midterm practical art skills test ceramics. Method, clay heating material clay. Mold the clay to make a desired shape. Leave it to dry in a cold area. Heat it up using the electric oven in the art room. Cool it down using the fridge in the watchman's room. Heat it up again using the electric oven. Cool it off slowly under a tap. See the vice principal's report. Marking, the shape and general appearance of the artwork, 60 marks. What you did to make it and the effort put in. 30 marks. The meaning of your artwork. 10 marks. Am I being killed? What was that fucking sound? What was that sound? I heard slime. Chad, I heard the sound of slime. Did you hear the sound of fucking slime? I heard slime. That was the roof crumbling. Oh, okay. I thought there was slime. It's an electric oven. Heat objects made out of clay. Okay, that's cool. Am I gonna make a gift? Am I gonna burn something? That sounds awesome. I tried to pick it up, chat. I tried to take this little bab, but I couldn't. The baby has been reunited with her mother. But there's a baby right here who hasn't been reunited with his mother, and he's just sitting there sad, staring at me. Ah, eh, whatever. What does the guy say about babies? <laughs> uh, uh, okay, the janitor shouldn't be a problem now, but this thing will be if you get too close to it again. Prepare for a lot of running around. We're making it a fucking pottery project. Okay. Calm down, baby Chan. All right, he's fucking angry. 
Baby Chan's angry. Baby Chan, please. I will make you some fucking pottery. Just calm the fuck down. Stop crying. Now then, what does the guide say about making ceramics? Mold clay to the desired shape. Leave it to dry in a cold area. Okay, I'd love to. I'd love to do that. Can you fucking stop with that? Okay, so apparently I need to put something in here. Oh, you little rascal. He's gonna ruin the whole fucking building. We already have a clay thing, chat. We have a clay thing. We have a clay thing we can use. We picked it up earlier. We're gonna fucking... We're gonna make this into something new. Okay, it's gonna be fine. Everyone just calm down. Stop it! Stop it! If you know what is good for you, you will stop crying! All right. Okay. All right, put the statue in the kiln. Finally! Dial it up to Omega Maximum. Let it cook medium rare. Open it up. Pick it up with your bare hands. Okay. Go to the first floor in the room with the refrigerator. I don't know which room has a fridge. I'll be right back, baby Chan. Chat, which room on the first floor had a fridge? Gotta get this thing cooled off in the fridge. <laughs> the one that had the lighter. Okay. I'm gonna guess every room. One's broken. Where's the fridge? Fridge. The fridge, 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 I remember. Now we just uh, sort of pull it out like so. Huck it in there, seal it for like, I don't know, three minutes. We'll know when it's done, trust me. All right, it's turned blue. It's done. Now we take it back and we cook it again. The baby's so mad. Chet, the baby is so fucking mad. I don't understand why the baby's so mad. Why is the baby so fucking mad? I didn't do anything wrong. I didn't do anything. Why is the baby mad? Stop crying. <laughs> why are you still crying? I'm doing what you asked. Why do you cry? Put it back inside the kiln. And we're going to cook this thing for another couple of minutes. It's ready to be taken out again. We need to get it underneath the tap. We need tap water. First floor. First floor has sinks, remember? Doesn't science from also have sinks? These aren't sinks. There's nothing. There's no sink in here. This is not the science room. Get, walk through saying go to the first floor. Walk through. Uh, but, 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 walk through says go to first floor. Go down a floor. Wait, no. Go to go to the third floor. Okay, we are doing. We're doing. It's going down a floor. We're going to this floor. We're going to the science room. Sink. I can't see in this condition. Where is the lights? <laughs> Which one of these had the sink water? Most of these are broken. I'm just gonna guess this one. This one's all glowy. This one's it. This one's it. Why? No, it wasn't it. It wasn't it. One of these. Oh my god. The baby's getting so fucking mad. It's only a matter of time till we die. Chat. None of these are working. This one's dribbling. That one's also just dribbling. We got water. We got water. This one's got water. Chill out. Complete clay doll. We got what we came for. Now, chat, we bring it back up to the baby. 
Now the baby will be happy. Really hope it doesn't fucking kill me. Sure hope I don't mess this up. Calm the fuck down. I've got your doll right here. I've got it right here. Here. Fucking little shit. You fucking try to kill me? Take it. They won't take it. Why won't they take it? I saw it all take it. Just take it. The monster is defeated. The baby is gone. The baby is gone. They've passed on to a better world. And me? The spoils of war. Wow, fucking really? Nothing? Just this? A baby has been reunited with her mother. Yeah, whatever. Must be fucking nice. First aid kit. I'll be taking that. And the seal. An amulet. The earth amulet. God, this game is pretty long, dude. I've been playing for fucking five hours, and that looks like I'm exactly halfway through the walkthrough. Fucking hell. Follow the hallway back to reach Act 3. Don't worry about saving here. Oh, I won't. Except I will. Before you leave that building... There's an Easter egg you might find interesting in this building with the mannequin. Go into the room with the mannequin, exhaust yourself, and spam crouching to the heel, whispering, and the mannequin walks towards you. Uh, is it gonna kill me if I fucking do this? Because I haven't saved. Is it gonna kill me? Because that's relevant to me. It shouldn't. I've never exhausted my stamina in the game before. The sta- the- Janitor's got a higher chance of getting me first. I see something. Yes. I can't see properly. It's too dark. Are you fucking sure, my guy? It's gamepad. I got it. I have no idea how to run so fast that, like, I get tired. We can come back to this place, technically, I think. If you spam crouch, apparently. Oh, I hear something. I'm about to die of a heart attack. I'm going to fucking die doing this. Are you sure? Hey, don't do that again. Arise, mannequin. Arise. 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 Chicken. Chicken, arise. It should drop something. It looks like it's trying to fucking kill me is what it's trying to do. Does it have to get me? I'm not letting it get me. That's it for the Easter egg if it has to get me, because I'm not letting it get me. I, I won't be doing that. Let him touch you. Oh my god, chat. This is gonna fucking kill me. And if it kills Go. Come on, let's fight then. Let's wrangle. Oh, they dropped it. They dropped it. Get away from me. Get the fuck away from me. Get away from me. Go back to your fucking corner where you belong. Go on now, get. I've had enough of you. Dropped it. Loser. Gloves. A pair of sanitary gloves. Can be used to ass stab the janitor. Stunning them for a good amount of time. That is pretty good. That is pretty good. Alright, that was worth it. Just don't do it five times in a row or he gets super aggro. <laughs> okay, well, I wasn't really planning on doing it any times in a He's gonna gatekeep me from leaving. 
I gotta get down to the floor. I think technically he's on floor three. Yeah, he was on floor three. Okay, we can go then. Let's get the fuck out of here. Janner can go to hell. All right? We're done here. Get the amulet of Earth. Plug it in. And let's get... Okay, you're cool. Okay, we're cool. We're cool. She and I are cool. I believe that's the music teacher. Well, chat, they said I wouldn't have to care about saving. It's a Naruto reference. <laughs> oh, chat. Oh, chat, you fucking stupid weebs. Oh, chat. Oh, chat, you fucking unbelievable weebs. Come on, man. You know when Naruto came out? A little bit after this. A little bit. A little bit after. A uh, couple years after. Uh, so no, it isn't a Naruto reference. <laughs> Unfortunately, or it, or I'd be pogging, and I'd be Naruto running around right now. Goku is my favorite Naruto. <laughs> Same, man. Same. I was told not to save doing this, because apparently I get a save point in a minute. So, uh, if I don't, let it be known. The new building is this way. Wow, what a really terrible hallway to say. And we're almost to the new building, chat. We're almost to the new building. So fucking close. To the new building. A regular school. Act three. Enter new building. New building, new janitor? Oh, this really does look like a fucking new building. Tragedy is the name of this one. Yeah, well, game, shut the fuck up. Tell me where the save point is, assholes. They said, don't worry about saving. I'm looking at this, and it's like, don't worry about saving. Fuck you. You're not going to be saving for a fucking while, asshole. Move to the stairs to watch a cutscene. Then you move to the second floor. Give me a save point right now. Oh, hey. <laughs> How you doing? They're gone. Dead or like left? Oh, vanished? That means nothing. You guys vanish all the time. I mean, it's going to be fine. You guys disappear fucking regularly. It means nothing. You shouldn't have come here. I didn't have much of a choice. Adding stakes into the ground around the school? This girl's fucking psycho. I don't understand. It was all your fault. <laughs> like, I look so fucking confused. Uh... Uh, let's look for a way to fix it. My guy, thousand yard stare. He doesn't even look at her. Do you know where the bathrooms are? <laughs> hey, crazy question. Key cards! Oh my god. Where are you going? You gotta you know where the fucking bathrooms are? You know where the toilets are? Toilets? Toilets! Toilets! Get excited! We're here! Toilet! The lights here actually turn- Where's the fucking notepad? Nice bathrooms. Nice human bathrooms instead of ones that are like in the ground. Is it good? Now where's the notepad? There's no ghosts in here, chat. This building's too new to have ghosts. We are, like, actually safe for the first time in a long fucking time. It's going to be very difficult for ghosts to haunt an area like this because, uh, ghosts are actually, um, they, they are drawn to, um, asbestos. Believe it or not. They're drawn to asbestos. 
So as long as you, you know, don't have asbestos in your new building, they will not be anywhere near you. They won't come near you. Hey, I didn't want to do a cutscene. I actually wanted to find these save points. Take a quick rest here. There better be a notepad on the ground, lady. There isn't. Well, this is a terrible fucking place to rest then. This is fucking, like, one of the worst places ever I've seen to rest. Oh my god. I'm, like, looking at this walkthrough, and it's like, you won't need to save. Go to hell. Okay, so now let's do about 40 minutes of gameplay. <laughs> Why can't I save? It's a note. School announcement. We began maintenance on the lighting in the new building's hall during the winter break. However, the builders we hired were substandard, and the electrics in some parts of the room are now ridden with poor wiring and bad insulation. The repairs to this damage are due to the summer holiday. Due for the summer holidays. Please heed the warning signs that have been put up and make sure you are aware of the temporary replacements in the meantime. Please be aware. If the light switches in classrooms 1, 5, 8, 10, and 12 are turned on with all other lights in the new building turned off, this will cause the light system in the hall to burst. That's epic. If you ever use the electrics room on the first floor, do not use the switch for the main hall's light under any circumstances. Okay. Hi, yeah, this new building's fucking like a real danger zone, gang. <laughs> Why does it blow up? She's tired. That's fine. I do everything anyways. Vibration and residence. Certain materials that are transformed when forced out of shape can go back to its original form when the force is removed. Objects with this characteristic are described as having elasticity. If an object with elasticity is not under force from an external source, then its vibration will come from the center of its parallel point. Vibration is the source of sound, and each object has a particular number of vibrators that each create a different sound. These numbers of vibrators are called characteristic numbers of vibrators. I, that's an, a really, really excellent fucking way to describe it, I guess. These numbers of vibrators are called numbers of vibrators. A single object can have several of these. Compulsive vibration is when an object moves seismic seismically, such as when there is an applied external force in mass and the number of vibrators and the characteristic number of vibrators are the same. This is actually, this game was made as an educational game uh, in Korean schools. Um, no one was really into it though, but it was actually an educational game at the time. Not many people bought it though. Not, not many schools picked it up. Unfortunately. One example is in 1940, the Washington Tacoma Bridge collapsed under strong winds just after four months of its opening. This was caused by the amplitude rising, leading to the bridge's collapse. This is because the strong wind was equal to the characteristic number of vibrators of the bridge. Sometimes you can find vocalists breaking glass with their voices because their voices have an equal characteristic number of vibrators to the glass. That's a real story, that bridge thing. Hey. Uh, that was a ghost that opened that closed that. Doors don't just close on their fucking own. Hey. That's gotta s <gasps> You can't save when you're with friends! That girl ain't my friend, notepad! Now let me say! <laughs> let me make something crystal! That girl ain't my friend! Alright, guy? She's nothing to me. <laughs> Let me save my fucking game. <laughs> Please. Okay. You'll, you'll, you'll be in front of the yellow door exam and it's very locked. It's very locked. Check the note on the wall. Take, the, take a look in the washroom and you'll see a save point. Don't use it just yet. There's no danger for now. Don't worry, gamer. Go back to the girl and open the darkened door next door. You'll see a cutscene. I already did that. Talk to the girl. Use the first response. Give her back the diary. Okay, I'm supposed to give her back her diary now. I didn't realize I was going to tell her I did that. I thought we were faking it. I thought we were faking it. Damaged item support. Language room. Recorder belt is damaged. Library power supply is damaged. Okay. This new building is a shithole. I got you a drink. It's room temperature soy milk. I've been carrying in my bag this whole time. Done. Yeah. I don't want any of your fucking backwash. Return the diary key. Return. I'm gonna give her back the diary. 
I stole this. You left it like an idiot on a bench. Yeah, you fucking did. I still don't know your name. I don't even know my name. My character's not anything. Wow, that was a hearty handshake, dude. <laughs> my name is Tomato Gaming. But with some extra Korean symbols. <laughs> what's fucking funny about it? You're not the you're not the first person to laugh. I wanna know what's funny. Go on. Is she gone? What are we doing? Wait, what are we doing? Why what are we doing? I'm just trying to talk to you. Okay, she's following me. Okay. <laughs> She's like backing away at me like I was scaring her. I just wanted to ask her what we were doing. Before following the girl, exit the room and take a look to the left. There's a single door you can open inside. It contains a save marker. Go back out to the hallway. Follow the girl up to the second floor. The AI can be wonky here, so give it some time. Okay, we are going to leave now. Shall we? Can I save yet? Is she still my friend? Oh my god. Okay, so she's following me. But we can't open any of these anyways, we don't have key cards. So uh, we're just leaving. Looks like this is the way up. We should move. Wait, where are we going? Guide, tell, help me. Uh, follow the girl up to the second floor. We are on the second floor. I guess she's just hanging out with me. We're going to the third floor. Because we were on the... We were on the second floor. This is the... Oh, yep. You see, I can tell you right away... That we don't want to be out there. Because that looks like a demon marking on the roof. In fact, I can actually see a soul seal over there. Hall notice. The rooftop key has been hung up on... The hall's main lighting system. This was a practical joke performed by one of the students. It is not funny. I added that because I know it's what they're thinking. Because it's not funny. Not many things in this world are funny. Believe it or not. I'm getting sick of people acting like it is, you know? That was lovely. So you're going to despawn soon so I can go run back to a save point? When do you fucking die? Hmm? Lady? I gotta ask. It's a map. I love maps. She has nothing to say to me. I think that means we're no longer friends again, which is good for me, because I gotta go save my game. It's a key card. That's how hands work. <laughs> oh, you never had a spooky thing happen? What, have you never had, like, a ghost fucking sharpen knives in your ear? Uh, are you hurt? Nah, she's fine. I don't need to fucking... She's on her own, dude. <laughs> and whatever gets her away from me. You know? <laughs> whatever lets me safe. Let's open the hallway. Did she just take the key card? Hey! I'm the protagonist. Give me that fucking card. Where are you going? Alright, she's... She's... Guess we'll just go. You think, do you guys think clothes are gonna come get us next? Is that like the next thing that happens? I think clothes are gonna get us next. Relegated to sidekick. Dude, I'm not the sidekick. Come on, chat. You guys see what I've been doing? What the fuck are you doing? Where are you? Lady? I had some trouble get- didn't have the guts to climb the rest of the stairs? Come along! Up the stairs! I think if I'm not behind her, she refuses to acknowledge that I'm here. Oh dear. No, here she goes. She figured it out. She just had to know that the stairs were safe. She wanted me, her sidekick, to walk up them first so that she could know that they weren't gonna kill her. Now that she's seen that they are not deadly, she is back on the path. It looks like we're unlocking that hallway on the far end. Ah, 
I'm amazed this game has worked without crash. Chappy, I haven't had like a real bug ever, which is pretty impressive. All things considered, for a game this old that I'm running like in a really fucking like bizarre, twisted way, my PC thinks it's Korean right now. It's pretty impressive. Uh, some student did a really fucking funny thing today and uh, threw the key up in an impossible to reach location So I guess no one gets on the roof now What is that? Don't schools usually try to avoid fucking three floor drops off of railings? Isn't that, like, the rule? Can't see it properly, it's too dark. Well, I know what I'm not doing. That. I'm going to go save my game now because she just ditched me. Save it. Save. On tragedy. Chat, there's no way I can beat this game tonight. It's long. It's at least a two-session game. So, the way I see it, we'll finish this... Maybe tomorrow, and if not, maybe the next day. Maybe Tuesday. Game has at least one to two more hours to go. The length of the walkthrough leads me to believe that it's closer to a full stream for me. It's looking like another three hours of game. Uh, if I wanted to stream it all the way through, and I don't think I can do that. Because I, I got stuff to do. Time to beat only has it at eight hours. Chat, I know a lot of you have been looking at the remake. That's not the game I'm playing. I'm playing a game... I'm playing the game that game is based off of. But, um... Yeah, no, most of that... Most of those details are not accurate. Uh, like, eight hours. That game, I've seen people... Apparently, people can beat the first game in two hours. And I've seen them... I, I, I saw, like, a walkthrough thing for it that was at two hours. With no skips. So, I'm not sure how accurate most of that stuff is anyways. But either way, this game's awesome. I had a lot of fun playing this. The janitor got a little bit on my nerves, uh, but I think that's just because of the difficulty I was doing. I loved it. I actually loved it. This was a lot of fun. Like, a ton of fun. This was a great game. And we're, I will probably beat it. This, this, is a, this is a very likely going to be beaten game. Now, if I stream tomorrow, I have to go. I have like a time limit because I got to do some stuff in the evening. So... I'm gonna leave it as a maybe. I sort of need to hear back from someone if they, like, what's the deal? Because if I am, then I have to be done by like 8 p.m. So I might not have time. If I can't beat, I, I have to beat it in second session. I just really would like to be able to do that. So more than likely, the next stream is going to be Tuesday. Okay? All right. More than likely, next stream will be Tuesday, unless something changes. I'm going to put the stream as a maybe. I'm going to put it maybe Monday, because I might just be like, fuck yeah, I can do it. And we'll start around like 3.30-ish. I'm going to put it at 3.30-ish, because I, I need to squeeze it. I got to do like a squeeze sort of thing. Okay? Actually, we'll put it at 4. But it'd probably be 4, like, sharp, if I'm in a stream. I'll, I'll, I'll talk about it in the chat. I'll be there like a couple, like 10 minutes or 15 minutes beforehand. Uh, you guys know how it is, okay? The Sock Mask, thanks for the five gifted subs. Very kind of you. Fox2102, thanks for the hundred bits. Very kind of you as well. Uh, Bushwookie, thanks for the... You didn't give me gift subs. You gave me a prime sub. You just got a rare accidental notification read because I don't read prime or normal subscriptions anymore because I don't have time. Congratulations, you're one in like 10 trillion. Billion. Wow. Billy Bob Cletus, thanks for the tier two gifted sub. Thank you very much. As usual, wait, Wizard Mal Malazar with another $5. Okay, so while all I can hear is laughing in my headphones, there's actual flickering lights outside my apartment building right now. And my room just got super chilly. So if this is my last donation ever I give, ever, I, last donation I ever give, ghosts haunted me to death. I see. Pretty radical way to go, though. Beastmate 1995 thanks for the $10. Thanks for the hours of entertainment. Hey, thanks for watching my entertainment. 
Fun stream today, chat. Fun stream. Sergeant Rorschach, four gifted subs. Thank you very much. Umbral Wind, five gifted subs. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Norwals, thanks for gifting us up as well. And happy morning with 500 bits. I probably miss people because I always miss people. One day, one day I'll use a platform that doesn't delete notifications, but... Uh, yeah. Yeah. Chat, I am out of here. You're never going to hear from me again until tomorrow, maybe. And you know how maybes are. But there's a decent chance I'll do it tomorrow. There's a decent chance I'm going to squeeze something... Just exclusively because I, uh, have a Wednesday stream coming up. Well, Wednesday comes up, and you guys know how cursed Wednesday is. So if I have a choice, I'd like to line up my schedule in such a way that I can avoid having to even think about streaming on Wednesday. So there's a chance we'll just do this again tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. Depends on if, like, my family is like, oh, we don't, we don't need you anymore. We changed our mind in the evening. So we'll see. We will see on that one. Either way, I'm out of here. Okay? I'm gonna raid... Oh, fuck. I wanna raid Charborg, but he's playing a game that I wanna stream. Eh, you guys... You guys will watch it twice. I'm gonna wait for it to be completely done developing. So I'm gonna raid Charborg. Okay. He's playing a little indie game I've wanted to stream for a while, but I'm waiting for it to finish development because it's still in early access and I sort of want it, I want it to be done because I won't return to it once I've finished, once I played it once. So, going out with Charborg, I will see you So You know what? I will stream tomorrow. It's going from a probably, maybe, to a really happening. <laughs> I'm just not sure how long it'll be. So I'll, have to, I'll find out in the afternoon if I'm going to be doing the second session of this or doing a different game because I don't have time. But then I'll definitely be streaming on Tuesday and then I'll probably be taking like a day or two off. All right? You know how it is. You guys are swell. You guys are, you guys are fucking awesome. You guys are great. You guys, like, even today, nothing. I didn't, I almost didn't read any messages that made me crung. No, there was a lot. But it wasn't so bad as I was expecting it to be when it comes to a Yaya -Ya game. So, you know. That's impressive. Small victories where you can get them. <laughs> Small victories. Goodbye.